Uh, Mooney Ponds Bowling Club for our, I think this is their third or fourth uh, finals game they've had here and I've got the, my name's Angus McIsaac, Vice President of Bowls Victoria and I've got Tris Doolan, Superstar All-Round President of uh, Yarra. Yarra and all-time bowler. So welcome Tris, welcome down here, thanks for coming down and helping us out today. Hi Gus, yeah, thanks for having me, it's an exciting day. It's great, what a beautiful day. Perfect conditions. And what are we here for? We're here to see the Prem A for the first year, the inaugural year of Prem A. Um, uh, this is uh, one versus two. It's uh, Deer Park versus Mooney Valley, the newcomers. Yeah, and haven't had, they had a good season. They have. If you had a look at them this year, you, see, you had a chance to get down. Played against them too. Yeah. <laughs> They're pretty hard to play against. And probably heard them too. They're pretty noisy too. You can hear too. them from the next suburb, actually. That's right. So I'll just run through the um, through the lineups here for for uh, those at home. Uh, on the far rink, uh, on this rink, sorry, we're showing uh, for the Mooney Valley team, Dylan Fisher skipping, James Frederico three, Steve Adame two, and Braden Ellis uh, up there leading. And they're playing Deer Park. And we've got the great Aaron Sheriff uh, heading, their, uh, heading their skipping with Chris Ball playing three. Uh, Anthony Larry Donoghue two and Paul Lawrence leading so it should be a cracking game. Should be. The greens look amazing. They really do. I'll really? just quickly run through your, the, uh, there's a, the other rinks. Mm -hmm. Kane Nelson uh, from Mooney Valley, uh, Alex Gilton playing three, Joshy Rennox and Jack Cassidy leading in that rink and they're playing Deer Park's Matty Bowes, James Pearce, Tommy Hicks and Connor McGuire leading that one. And uh, two other teams, we've got Nathan Lynch from Mooney Valley, Bradley Gibson, Jack Thompson and Riley Boxall. And Jay By Norris heads up the Deer Park team with Mark Casey, Nathan Bush and Chris Grain. What a rink that is. Superstars. Number one rink, I think they are. You would think so. In the league. I think they, they do, do rate at the top of the pops. I think they do. 
And the other, at last but not least, you've got uh, Matty O'Brien for Moody Valley, Michael Sims, Nathan Lewis and Ryan Beavis. And Sean Ingham's come down from Queensland to head up R Ryan Tayton, Andrew Price and Winston Brackley. So we're going to have a start, it's a star-studded game. Both these teams have been um, on their game all year. One point separating, separating them. them. At the amazing. end of the At season. The the season. And also when they played each other in round 11. It, you, 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 not a hair One between shot. them. Yeah. Yep. So they've kicked off here, and um, it looks like they've got some. Uh, just trying to see, it's, it's a bit of a, a bit of a uh, close measure there, I'd say. Yeah, they were both. Both the skippers were looking at those bowls, trying to separate the two, actually. So it, it might be, be an umpire call at this point. Yeah, unless that's um, Paul Lawrence's and Anthony Donahue's. I know he's a light blue, so. They might have just been looking to see if it was a toucher. Yeah. So the guys did uh, uh, finish their end uh, roll-up pretty early and just jumped the gun on us a bit. They Trish, did. So we've been scrambling a little bit, so we do apologise for that. There's a bit of traffic today, too, getting out here. So Melbourne's crazy. Busy day. Yeah, it is. Around town. Oh, Dylan's chasing this one. Yeah, he's just got to let go there. Got to release. It's close. Jeez, look at the finish on that bowl. Shot. That just rolled on for an age, didn't it? Yep. So it's two to Deer Park. Yep. Chris has indicated. Yeah, it's Paul Lawrence's and Anthony yep. Donahue's bowls. There. See the support, though, from the Mooney boys just then with Dylan getting up and about yep. nice and early. He was close. So that'll be two to, two to Deer, Park. Deer Park. Deer Park. Uh, Mooney Valley have probably, you know, come into this uh, new concept and uh, have been probably one of the most up and about teams that I played against um, this year. A lot of voice. Yes, and I think that gives them that extra little bit, that extra five or ten percent. Oh, there's no doubt about it, and, and it's not um, uh, manufactured. It's real. That these guys hang out together. They, you know, they, they've got each other's backs. Genuine team camaraderie, isn't it? Yeah, champion totally. team. Yeah. We played, uh, we played them. Uh, that being, uh, um, uh, uh, <laughs> where where am I? I'm out in, in um, Footscray, and uh, th we played them the first game, and uh, they just overran us in the end. Yeah. Um, okay. Was yeah. it close? I, can't, I don't remember the scores, but oh, it was probably ten or twelve in the end. Oh, but they really did overrun us. Yeah. They weren't the first only team to do that. Uh, <laughs> to do that to you us. Had a pretty good season. Yeah. Braden Ellis on the mat now. Of course, Braden's come across from Ivanhoe. Yep. So he was in the Yarra region. Extraordinary bowler. Bit of family history with the Ivanhoe Bowls Club. Oh, his grandpa was a super bowler. That's it. Mm. And he's fitted right in at Mooney, from what I hear. Look at this. Who reply? Yeah. Here they've, you go. They've, they've just come out and started. started from that yeah, they first have. Bowl. Yeah. I didn't see how much was on the next drink. Just no, another. I did put one up on the board to Deer Park. Is that Bows? Uh, that's the next rink, yep. yep. Bowsy, and uh, he's got uh, James playing three for him. What a handy three. What a great team Snorkel, they are. Yeah. Yep. James Pierce. Of course, he was skipping at one stage too, wasn't he? So he's easily... He's some... Um, he did skip early, and then they slipped him back as a three percent because you've got to fit your flying players in. Yeah, um, he's very versatile, isn't he? Yeah, you can put him anywhere really. Yeah. Oh, close. Lots of support on the uh, live stream here for Mooney Valley. Uh, they'll have all their supporters. There'll yeah. be a few down here. It's starting to fill up now, and uh, there'll be a few you know, coming down and seeing the sun out. Got the barbecue going Absolutely. and the bars open. And it's a fantastic venue. Larry just trying to get one in around the back there. Steve Adamo. Steve Adamo was uh, on commentary the other day. Did a great job. I think it might have been Friday night he did oh, did he? for us. Yeah. Was that the Danny Long Whittlesey? Yes, that was the, yep. Mm -hmm. 
fair sort of bowl. Yeah, good bowl here. He's a bit of a um, spiritual, he's a bit of a spiritual leader at the club, <laughs> and he's played a bomb. He'd have his hands full with all these young bucks coming uh, in. Yeah, I think he'd uh, keep up with them somehow. <laughs> Goes all right. What's Larry going to do here? He'll have something to say. He's asking it to get down. Just He's going to finish in a great home. Wow. What a solid play that Larry is. He's, uh, just gives his ball a chance. Of course, we've got a game going on behind us too, Tris. Um, mm. That's the... Uh, that's the uh, knockout game between Melbourne and Bundura. Indeed. Third versus fourth. Uh, yeah. Melbourne finished third and Bundura fourth. So the uh, no more games for the loser. Yeah, that'll be a tough battle next door. Yeah. For sure. Who do you back out of those two, Gus? Um, well, you can never really not back Melbourne. They're just perennial, aren't they? They are a bit. They you seem know. to find, find a way, don't they? Yep. Yep. Some of the teams this year, you can see, it, it doesn't always play out the way you think. That you know, some teams just like have the wood over other teams. They just have that mental edge or, or something. It has just fallen that way this year. So this this game we're watching here is so vital. Um, obviously, when it goes into the final, direct. Yep. Um, and would you want to be playing any one of these teams behind us? <laughs> no. No. Okay, that far rink has just put their score up for their first so end. So we're just missing. We're just missing the. Yeah, that's a. Two. We can only update the scores as they do. Yeah, two to uh, Mooney Valley. Yeah. It's that Matty O'Brien's rink, isn't it? Yep. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> well, there's going to be a bit of noise today. Oh yeah. Might have to turn down the um, effects mics. You do think. <laughs> Chris Ball on the mat. Has he got new bowls? Has he been using those all season? Mm, no. Mm. Well, Steve Adamo is still sitting Ooh, there. He's having a little... needs to get down. Actually, mate, I think he has had them most of the season, actually. They're a nice colour. Hmm. Greeny purple. Of course, we both played with Chris back in the day. Yeah. Q Heights. Q Heights. He was skipping for us then. Yeah. Yeah, you just, just overplayed that slightly. Easy to do. What speed do you think the green's running at, Gus? 15, I think. Yeah. It looks, it's you know, it is. They always present the club and they the do. greens so beautifully here. Great to have them as a partner. The Prem Final's been here for a few years now, haven't they? Yep. Well, he's having a positive uh, crack at this. He's just a bit wide. I spent the uh, couple of days watching Aaron up at the BPL. Oh, yes. In Moama. Yes. So he could probably eat a bowl at the minute. Um, I don't know how they do it. They just get up and put their bowls gear on and throw down another some more bowls. It's amazing. Good afternoon, Brendan. Just saying hello to us. Yeah, it's just rolling on from one tournament, one game to the next, isn't it? Oh, well, they're just professional players yeah. now. They... Just trying to... Just going to pull up on him. Actually, you know... That's probably a bit of a nuisance bowl. Yeah. Well, I think that's... Oh, my God, here. That's James. I met he's a couple down, I think. That's James mm. Frederico's bowl, the yellow bowl. He's... Oh, wow. Look at that. Look at that. Right on cue. Mm. That's the... Uh, that's Larry's bowl at the back. Sky blue one. 
That was perfect weight for what he wanted to do. People reckon they're lucky. I just reckon mm. they play with good line and good weight. Yeah, <laughs> the luckier you get. Yeah. yeah well, their bowl stay in the head. I mean, that, that yeah. bowl is stayed on the green. Yeah. Has he got a sh what shots he playing here? Has he got a look at it? He's probably two down. Yep, so that was probably a four shot turnaround. I was trying yep. to get whose bowls are whose at the moment. Okay, is he looking for the jack clean here? Oh. How many was that? Two? Two. Just doing the board now, so. Mm hmm. Just be a minute. And they'll be doing live scoring, of course, today, so you can follow your live scores on the uh, portal. That's why they pay. Uh, that's why they pay the big man to come down and play. He, that's what he does. So yeah. As he said, a four-shot turnaround. Assuming that was two. Was I didn't two. see Chris put his fingers up. No. They haven't done the board either. So. No. Actually, I'll have a look on the uh, board yeah. myself. That's easy. What sort of pace does? Can you have a look at Jay Bye's first hand too, please? Yep. Get the outside of hmm. Hey, Coggy. Oh, what a great start again from Braden Ellis. Bit of wind getting up here. You might be able to hear that through the microphones at home. Nothing on, um, on the light on the uh, scoring app. Okay. We will endeavour to update the scores as quickly as we can, but we can only do what the guys are That's giving right. us. That wind has got up. It has, and it's running across the green. So you saw that last bowl just hold out a little bit, and that's because the green is running. The wind is running across the green. Interesting that Braden is choosing to bowl with the wind, yeah. as opposed to getting He's stuck out there. Well so great shooting. Gets a high five from his skipper. Larry on the mat now, playing the position of two. And of course, when your lead hasn't nailed it, you're just playing the position of lead. Really, something in the head for them. Yeah. He's played it pretty well. Great shot. That's, Great that's shot. Superb by Larry here. So Shortingham got, uh, uh, Matty O'Brien got a two. We got that, didn't we, on the first end? Yep. And uh, now we'll just have a look at Jay Byers. It's a, a two and a uh, just looking which way. Oh, yeah. On the first end, they got a one, Mooney Valley. And on the second end, they got a two. That's Nathan Lynch's three. So the score is 3 0. And I think it's the same next door with Matty O'Brien. He got a two and a one. Is that right? Uh, yeah. He got a. I've only got a two there. Uh, they got three on the scoreboard, so. Right. So it'd be a two and a one. Yeah, that's what I've got. Yep, good. And it looks like Jay got, did you say Jay Boy got two on the first end? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, no, Jay, no. Um, uh, Nathan Lynch got a one on the first end and a two on the second end. Okay. You've got to read these things backwards. Matty Bowes got a one on the first end. And a one on the second end. Hasn't come up. It looks like he's got two. 
Yep. And we were right with uh, Aaron Sheriff's got a two and a two. Yep. James Frederick on the mat. That's Larry's bowl sitting just behind the... It is, yeah, back hopper. Fair, this will bite. This should bite. This is a great yeah, shot. awesome. <laughs> uh, they love it. Yeah. We had a great angle for that. It just sitting right behind. You can just see it bite and turn. Chris Ball having a run at it. Close. Oh, wow. Yeah. It's left the uh, Braden Ellis' bowl. Two. It's got to yes, two. it has. Yeah, Braden Ellis and Steve Adamo's bowls are still sitting there. Lovely hit by Chris. Didn't get the result he wanted, but... You just... You've got to be in the area first, Chris, don't you? And uh, you don't always get the result that, uh, oh, it's a good ball too. Yeah, he was in the area. Yeah, so. yeah. Well, they have come here to play. Chris and Darren are standing there just sizing this up. I'm not too sure who owns the, I think Braden Ellis has got a ball at the back and I don't know who's got the very back. That's, um, oh, that's one of Steve's bowls. He owns the uh, plinth, the white bowl. Yeah, okay. Splice, is it? Yeah, yeah. I, I just called it white, but oh, it is a splice, isn't it? Mm, yeah. yeah. A very dull, dull. <laughs> so I called it white on my sheet. <laughs> these, are, these are an interesting. He's got blue with this sort of yellow wiggle through it. He's saying no, it's not going to get back, and he's right. His weight is perfect for it. And there was no wind then, was there? it? No, died. it's probably, yeah. yeah Actually, yeah. it is gusting, yeah. and the wind has just dropped if you look at the flags, whereas they've been coming in sideways there. Nice position to be in when you're a skip. You're holding three. Mm. He'll be looking to just get beyond the, the um, head. Yeah, just maybe even just tuck that jack out of oh, yeah. sight, do you think? Yep. I, I think he likes the hole that's there. I mean, you don't want to fill a hole and let um, the opposition use it. He's just tried to get down underneath the bowl and wouldn't come. See, that's hung a little bit too. Yep. just shows you the wind is kind of gusting around out here. Now, if he tightens this up, it'll, it'll be interesting to see if it ducks. Needs to run, I yeah, think. Yeah, I don't think he's got. He's got the line this time, but it's not quite the right weight. All right, big bowl from the skipper here to add right oh. to even it all out. Adding's the game. It is. When you're holding. So he's holding three, isn't he? I think so. Draw for four. He's chasing it. You'll get a big reception if he gets it. Oh, he certainly yeah, he, will. He's running good. He just got bite. Still going. Oh, yes, they will He's ride done. that all yeah. the way in. Yeah. That's what you fear as a team playing these guys. You don't want to fire them up. No. <laughs> no, no poking the bear. I think Aaron's already put that score up. Can you see that, Gus? He, he's just standing in the way. <laughs> it should be four all. It should be. Yep, four all. Yeah. So it's been a really um, amazing start. It just uh, the guys have just come on and just on song. Um, there is. 
I didn't look back in the record books, but if these guys win today and make the final, I, I think they'll be the first team ever to make a final, having come into the competition the year before. Wouldn't surprise yeah. me. I mean, how often do you see people come up for one year and actually go down, let alone make the final? Yeah. It's been extraordinary, yeah. their journey. And I don't, did they recruit many players, do you know? Uh, yeah, Michael Sims um, came in. They brought... Um, Matty O'Brien. Matty O'Brien, Dylan Fisher, um, Alex Skilton. Mm -hmm. So, look, you, you, you know, they're using their own players. Yeah. If, you, if you can call Michael Sims a, you know, import, yeah. Tasmanian, but, you know, um, they're all sort of local players, really. Loose to start for this one from their point of view. And it's almost like a pressure valve was released there, and we'll just see how they uh, get back on their game. Sometimes, you know, those first couple of ends are the nervous ends, and uh, the pressure's released, and you sort of get into your flow of your game. Larry will back himself to draw a shot here, I think. Boys, be good. Do I have to do it in that box for the whole time? Hold on, hold on, hold on! Hold on. Oh. Oh. Break up! 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 He's just waiting to. They're watching another rink. Steve's following this. He's got a good ball. Good ball, Steve. Yep. Solid as a rock. Gets a high far from his skipper. Larry likes it. He's just got to run a little bit. Falls a little bit short there. We won't be happy with that. Beautiful delivery by Chris Paul. He just gets the ball away beautifully. And we'll, he's got a fairly good ball coming in there. That's a great ball by Chris Paul. Just moves the kitty back to uh, to Larry. Larry's ball. So makes holding two. Yeah. They own the back, so uh, he's going to play a little bit of weight, I think. Got a bit of weight, look for the gap. Oh, he was very close. close. Sewing this off again, he you just try and clear the white bowl of uh, Steve Adamos, just try and get to the back, and he's done that. 
That's a great bowl. Very handy home. Resting toucher. Hmm. You're happy with that as a skipper, yeah. wouldn't you? Yeah. Two great bowls. Well, I still think we might see some um, action. He's rubbed his hand on the grass. Let's get, make sure he's got a nice dry grip. All right. And he's going to... He's looking for it. Yeah. Jack in the pit. Bowl out. Oh, wow. Oh. How did he find that hole? That is... Try doing that twice. Can't do it. <laughs> then again, fucking Dylan Fisher could. He's that good. <laughs> Sheriff's got to go to the back, doesn't he? Well, they're holding the back. Chris Ball's bowl is backest. Oh, it is the backest. Oh, it is too. Yeah. It did get there. So, yeah. it's just going to block the hole up. I think you can still see that pile of Chris Ball's. Those coloured bowls stand out. You can see the green and purple. It goes again. A bit more controlled. You got one out. Bowl out. I was just going to try and get to that other. No, he, yep, they pick up a one. Who's that? Who got a one? That was uh, Deer Park pick up a one. One on five. Yeah. Is it one on four? Sorry. Yeah. No, it's five because Dylan got the four. Oh, true, four. true. Yep. They're moving along. They're not wasting any time here. Yep. Yeah, they played four ends on that. I think five, four. Oh. Yep. No, they are moving along. I think they've got somewhere to be tonight. <laughs> Great ball by Paul Lawrence. So Paul's, it's interesting, Paul's playing that tighter hand and, and uh, yes, Braden's playing the opposite. As we say that, the wind has just stopped. Yeah. Braden's playing really well. He's, he's, he's had a great year. Yeah. yeah. He's close here. And it'll here. bite at the end, yeah, too. Look at this. Yeah, you're right. There you go. Look at that. Almost on cue. Great reply. Again. I mean, Braden was at Ivanhoe for a long time, you know, and, and sometimes, look, he's amongst a really good group of bowlers, and that's just got to lift your level. Where he's probably the big dog, where he was. Paul Lawrence, another Fair great reply. ball. So it looks like uh, over on Javi's rink, he's six zero down, but we didn't know. They just put it all up in one go. Right. With those three ends. Yep. Do you want to have a look at how yep, that mate. happened? I'm going to have a look. Thank you. Won't hurt down the back there.
Good positive call there from Dylan Fisher, saying you're playing the forehand really well. Just be up and pass the jack. It's probably a two and a one and three. Yeah, whatever well, equals six. they were three. It was a one, a two, and a three. Okay, opposite J by. Yep. So there's six love down. Yep. Yep, that, that, that makes sense. On three. Yep. Good. We just need another pair of hands today. We Tristan, do, actually. We? We're newbies at this uh, technical stuff, but. Uh, so the talking if, bit's easy. <laughs> I, I've, I can't disagree with you there. It's pretty quiet behind us. It is a bit. Mm. What's Steve done here? He's following it down. Looks to need a petrol station. Yeah. yeah. Going to go the long way round. Yeah. You have to put the petrol in. Yeah. Maybe we've got electric bowls coming up. <laughs> Disco guy. Well, this is definitely reaching. Or not. Well, it's not going to come. It needs to release. Many of Bryce played a big ball. I love the banter. Yeah. A little tap from Lynchy next door. Don't know how many they got, but it's um, welcome to Melbourne, Shawningham. Could be six, could be one mm. with Mooney. That's exactly right. You're going to do the score now. Seven. That was a four. Seven, three. On four. Yep. Now, I think that was uh, a big turnaround there. Chris is urging this to be up. He's got his line. He's just got to run. Yeah, just a foot or so. James is just going to get down or just be on that ball there. It's a great home. So did you say that was a 4-2? Yeah, Wasn't far away. No, Omar drew the shot, um, so he's trying to add another one. He likes it. What did he say? I didn't you hear just that. Tell by his yeah. body language there. Yeah. Oh, he's just going to 
probably would have been right on, you know. Okay, Dylan's going to look for the jack here. Yeah. What's the jack in the pit worth? Uh, well, Anthony Donahue's bulb is back there. At, you want, they want it to the right, so be, there's two bulbs there. I'm not, sure it, I'm not sure it'll get there. He's got the bowl. Okay, so. One to Deer Park, yeah. they're indicating, I think. Well, is that Braden's? Yep. yep, one to Deer Park. Yep. yep. Yeah, it was Paul Lawrence's bowl. Stayed there. Six, four, and six. Yep. Well, it's always concerning when you see a rink that hasn't scored yet. Seven love down. Yeah. I know it's early days, but these guys will find a way to get back. be another four to come on the lynch rink is it that's what i'm trying to look that's what i'm trying to see okay and it would be on the uh fourth end That on the so four on the fourth end. Well, they got a, a one or two is three. There's seven love down and saying on that scoreboard, yeah, I know. but it doesn't make any sense. Yeah, I just sort itself out. We'll Finished in a good home there. Yeah, he's always in the area. Yeah, and doesn't play short bowls, you know, like plenty of options for the uh, for the back end. his time Steve considers what he wants to do thinks about it it's a good lesson for people watching it doesn't hurt to take a bit of time and he accordingly he's played a good bowl he's around it falls in yeah Dylan like that Steve lines up again. Kind of likes it. He's sort of eyeing it off. Stalking it down the green. Yeah. He's close. 
touch his own bowl down. Great second ball. Oh my Look goodness. Didn't... Two awesome bowls there. Yeah. Down. Oh, so, <laughs> so excited, one of the guys nearly broke his leg. <laughs> Fell off the... He's, he's putting his finger up. It's lucky he didn't twist his ankle there. Ah, uh, yeah. If it was you or me, probably. Oh. Broken hip, guys. Yeah. Chris Ball coming down. Oh. Mm. It's a good ball. It's Paul Lawrence's yeah. ball. They were probably down to Steve Adamos. I think that's uh, turned that around. Yeah. You hear the Mooney Valley boys already? Yeah. Here we go. They're, they're up and about. Yeah. Are Deer Park are traditionally not as noisy, are they? No, they're not. They just go about the business. No, they're not like a Melbourne. No. You know, it wasn't the top of their game, you know. There's just noise everywhere. You just didn't know what was going on. Uh, two to uh, Mooney Valley. On the Bowsy ring, did yep. you say? Kane Nelson, champion from Queensland, young champion. I think he's only 21 or 22. Yeah, big future in bowls. Oh, yeah. He's got a brother who plays too. He's pretty good. Kane Sugar, they call him. Oh, of course. <laughs> good effort there. Good effort there by James. Was that one to Deer Park on the far rink, on the Ingham rink? Um, seven four. Yeah, one to Ingham. Mooney Valley have just kicked out to a you know a little little bit of a, a lead, largely in one rink at the minute. But it doesn't matter where you get them from as long as you as close here. Oh, great down. shot, Dylan Fisher. Yeah, well that's that's just made three there. That was an awesome ball. Playing weight is Omar. He wants more. Oh, he got the kitty. Got the next best thing. Larry gives him a big clap. What a ball. It's great to have that sort of firepower. And they go back for the reset. They're sending the balls back down the green. Chris pulls. I think Chris liked that. Gives him a high five. Paul likes it. Paul nearly drops his ball. <laughs> Go back for the reset, Steve. Mm. Steve just walked past. Go. He loves the, loves the stash. He'll love this. More ends the better.
I do know that. But, You've all, most of the rinks have got their mats back. Um, not playing f exactly full length. Paul Lawrence sets off again. Just on that tighter side, it's just not quite giving, as you can see. That lovely weight. There's uh, another one onto the lynch rink. You're really applying the pressure in that uh, uh, in the lynch J by game. The boys are really. Um, Stacking them on and putting them under it under the pump. had some technical issues there some apps are dying scoring apps are dying and it's all a learning curve for uh, for everything that's going on the of course up yes. in the prem a and b i think were you using live scoring uh, yep. app? yeah yeah it's yep. great isn't it it's fantastic yeah. yeah so but apparently one of the rinks has already gone down so they're not using it they're using the old-fashioned scorecard yeah another big bowl another big pole played by kane nelson Gets high fives all around. Baz is up to the task. How's you like this? Sails through. Chris won't be too happy with that one. He's human. Happens he from time to time. Yeah, well, they just do strive on perfection, these guys, and they don't play many bad bowls. And as you said, they're just as uh, likely to play them as you and me. <laughs> Bit of noise on cue from behind us. Something's going on. Yeah. That'd be Melbourne, I reckon. Yep. How's James? Look here. He's just trying to get back. They're just struggling a little bit on the line on some of these. Giving their bowls a chance, though. Let's see Chris's correction here. He's just a little bit heavier. 
He's going to get a bit of assistance. No. Oh, Nelly did. Oh, he got the rub. You never mind the assistance, do you? No. Means you're in the area. Got the trot going, Dylan. It's a little bit of room there. He's trying to add to Steve Adamo's bowl, yellow bowl. He's got a great bowl here. He just nearly landed. He nearly did, as didn't they're he? Out there. Yep. yep. Beautiful wave. You need two in the head against Aaron. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> you know he's going to come hunting, don't yes. you? Oh, yeah. Yeah. They take their opportunities. Uh, seven, two on the bows. Yeah, to Mooney Valley. Yep. Get to that in a sec. Just a bit quicker than you wanted to be. <laughs> Tell you what, that is a fair effort. Uh -huh. Yeah, he's still one down the uh, yellow yep. bowl. Steve Adamo is still holding. And Dylan's still got one more to come. Yep. He wasn't far away. He can just hit that no, bowl. No, he just land one of, land one of those. Mm. Uh, the Jay Bowie Norris Ring have the mat. They're on the board. They're on the board. Let's see what they got. I think it might just flick a ooh, ooh, four. four. Eight, four. Eight, four on six. Mm -hmm. He's close. He's very close. He's got this. He's got this. Come on, down to the bowl. What a shot. Pop in and flop in. Oh. Yep. Two, They're indicating two to Mooney Valley. Such an important element of a skipper's role. You know, we talk about conversions and all these sorts of mm -hmm. things, but those ads I'm a big fan of, as I've said before. He calls them in together. I think he kind of likes the start they've had. He's probably just saying, look, we probably need to be a little bit tighter. We've just got to find that line. Our weight's good. Just find the line. Close game behind us. Uh, Melbourne 10, Bandura 11. Close game indeed. And 666 on the show rink. Ah, uh, right. You're not a numerologist or anything, Tris. Yeah. What the stars it. say? No, just the stars. Yeah. What is it? It's the year of, hmm. year of the uh, something. Yeah. Someone will tell us. How many did Jay Bye get? Four. Yep. It's a good good way to get on the board. Hmm. Relieves a bit of pre pressure, tension. Braden giving his ball a chance there. But it, it might be displeased with that. How many ends has J-Bo played? Five or six? I can't Five. see the board. I think it was. No, six. Six? Yeah. Yeah. 
crowd's building up nicely. Got plenty of uh, plenty of chairs here for if, if you are local and close by, get down here. Yeah, the atmosphere is electric. It you can is. feel it, and it's just going to keep building for the afternoon. Yep. You got your entries in for the Vic Open, Tris? I do. Yep. I do. Got Gus. Yep. yep. You? All sorted. Yep. Yep. I have. I got a, a, a uh, saw some of the Bowls Australia guys up at um, Moama, and they gave me a clap for getting my entries into the Australian Open this year. I forgot the last you two years. You did too. I remember that. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Set to go into the pool, just get in the back way. Yeah. So, um, which which you know was able to do. But and numbers are up early. Yep. The AO. Yep. And um, yeah, you need to get your entries in for the Vic Open closing very soon. Yeah, tonight I think it's 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 closing. So if you if you're sitting at your computer now and you're thinking. Might mm. get down there for you don't have to play in all the events, of course. You know, there's um, they're spread out over a couple of weeks, and um, you can get down and if you just want to go on the singles or something like that. I yep. think the singles are on the weekend, aren't they? Yes, I think so. So that's done, it's that way. So, you know, I know everyone loves a good game of singles, so come down for a night, um, invest in the country, spend some money. It's a fun, sure you, it's a fun time. Uh, Get to make some new friends, get to know some other bowlers. The hospitality there was sec first class last year. It was just absolutely fantastic. Yeah. Cameron just, Cameron Curtis is asking us, is the green tiff? Yes, it is. Yep. And thank you, Elaine, Year of the Dragon. I knew it was uh, something. I think last year was Year of the Monkey. Our brains trust. Yeah. Yeah, it's a good time down there at the Vic Open. Yep. Yep. Yep, now we're down there for a couple of years and, and uh, it, uh, it's, it'll just build on each year, I think. Yeah. We didn't quite get the full weather that we wanted last year. Oh, I wasn't going to, I was just thinking that, the rain. I was lucky enough not to get caught in it, but if you were drawn on some of the outside greens and yep. we had a bit of inclement weather. Yep. But the local clubs did an amazing job. The hospitality is fantastic, isn't it, at those... Oh. They couldn't, yeah. they, they couldn't do enough, the clubs. They were amazing. I think it was Merbu North, where yeah. the football club is heavily involved with the bowling club, and it's all very social. Yep. And the ladies there made homemade slices yep. and all sorts of things for yep. us. It was great. Yep. Absolutely. Can't wait. Steve just asking, what bowls is Sheriff using from Moama? Um, the, it wasn't what he was using up there. Mm, different um, set from yeah, the Moama ones. Different set. Yeah. I didn't get a chance because we, I started early. I really didn't get a chance to have a look at what he's got. I haven't seen that colour before though. Good shot there. That's the boss. Chris got a bit of work to do here. He was just trying to come and arrive on the last ball. Yep. He's just on the tight side here because that will run away a little bit. It's just that tail at the yep. end, isn't it? Yep. Fair weight. James, do it again. It's got a nice little leg swirl there happening. That was a little like watching the skip and a jump. Yeah. Oh, needs to release. He knew straight away. He was he sort of calling, pulling that back. Yep. Yeah, it'll be all right if it stays up. Just came out a touch Ooh. hot. And I think that's that willingness just to, to push out against the breeze there, um, to push it out. Yeah. Just overdid that. What's Chris going to do here? Very accomplished and experienced bowler Chris Paul is. He's, He's close here. He, he, He's really bowl. close. Look at this, just run around this. Lance on the bowl. And, oh, oh, wow. That's my first wow of the day. That was a close, That was a little bit stiff. Yeah. A little bit heavy, I guess. So Alex Skilson's playing three for uh, Kate Nelson. And when Kane's not here, uh, Skilson steps up and skips. Does a pretty good job there. He's a, just a, a dynamite bowler and a power packet on the green. He's just so, so effervescent and, out, you know, just great to play with, I'm sure. 
Yeah, some people just have that knack of bringing a bit more than just their bowls, isn't it? Like, yep. you know, you can, you can have an off day with your bowls, but you can still bring something to the team and the rink and just in presence. Yep. Aaron's bowls definitely look like Optimus, don't they? Yeah. Here. I don't think Ken Slight would make a colour like that. I don't think so. Oh, look at this, straight back. And down on his knee. Lynch's got the... Interesting tussle over there. Well, Ingham, the mm. Ingham ring was celebrating and it lasted for about two seconds yeah. because Lynch just got up there and just drowned him out. Yeah. I was very... I Oof. watched Mooney Valley in the final last year against Essendon when they won and I, it, it, that was, you know, just amazing to watch. If, if anyone... Go back and have a look. It mm -hmm. was just... Uh, they really just... Um, I wouldn't say destroyed them, but they just played with no fear. Yeah. Was that three or four? That was three or four to Lynchy then. Right. That was a big turnaround. Yep. Here we go, J-Bo's doing the board now. Yeah, 12. It's four. Tw yeah. So it's now 12-4 12. 12. Yep. to Mooney Valley. High scoring match because mm. J-Bar got a, his four in one shot too, didn't he? So. He did. Oh, Mas, look at this. He's got the ball clean. Got the ball clean. Two, 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 two uh, Deer Park to Omar. He took, mm -hmm. he took out the um, James Federico's bowl. Clean as a whistle. Clinical, one might say. It was. We were talking about that before. You've got to have more than one in the head. Mm. You know, easy to say, hard to do. Back to work. You know what's really interesting with this game is how much do you think the noise is worth in value as it wears you down over the day? Like Deer Park are pretty quiet compared with Mini Valley. Yep. I wonder how much value is in that. I think there's a fair bit, you know, especially if, you know, I, I don't think Deer Park get caught up in that. Um, but it is, an, it is the, the energy that's created. You, yeah. You kind of feel like you've got to do something to keep it in the bottle, you know, yeah. and... Um, and if you go to celebrate, like just happened yep. across the rinks there and they just shut you down straight away with a big bowl with a six or seven shot turnaround, it's difficult it's to get back. momentum. Yeah, yeah you're trying yeah. to get... Yeah. And they can do it all day and all night, these, these Mooney Valley guys. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it doesn't... Uh, And I've seen teams try and manufacture it, you know, and it doesn't work. No, it has to be natural, doesn't yeah. it? It has to be authentic. Yeah. But you need a couple in your side who can do it. Yeah. Um, but it has to be their natural state. Yep. Yeah. Well, I think Braden's just going to... Okay. Just cross the head a bit there. So they've just edged away slightly more. I think um, Deer Park would be wanting to sort of stem the tide a little bit. They don't want to... Um, I think I find, you know, 12 or 15 starting to get out there a little bit. But it is nothing to get back. Of course, four rinks, you, can, you score on four rinks at the same time, you get that 15 back like that. But yeah, yeah. It can happen very quickly at this level. Steve's bowling well. Yes, he is. Really well. This is it. Yeah. Yeah. So 
seven all on the Ingham and O'Brien rink. Yep. There's seven all on seven. Yep, seven, seven, seven. You'd love to get that in there. Have we got 12-4 in the Lynch J by rink on yep. N7? Yep. And 7-5 seven, seven, five five. on seven. Yep. So cool. it just, you know, we talked, to, that just brings it back a little bit, back to yeah. eight shots. That's nothing. No, no. I think that's a comfort area. You'd be comfortable just working away there with that. Chris's weight is pristine. Oh, yeah. yeah. It's just holding on him. It's oh, close. No, it's the boss. Yes. Yep. It's the one. Ball. You were out here a couple of years ago with MCC. Indeed. In fact, we played on this ring. You did. And I played directly against Larry Donahue. Yep. And I think they had... Alex Marshall skipping. Yes. Is that be right? Yep. Yeah. I did. I think I called the game. Um, did you? Yeah. Doesn't seem that long ago. And does, does A lot changes. Oh, yeah. It doesn't seem that long ago, no. Alex Marshall, I don't think he played the whole season. I think he was just... I can't remember. Yeah. But it was... Yeah. And the greens were beautiful. The greens are always great here. Because uh, I played him that same year, and he had um, Tyson Cromey, I think, playing. That's correct. Sir. Larry, too, and um, Kobe That's leading. It. That was That's the it. rink. Yeah. Yep. Did you commentate that game? Yep. 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 Oh, he's great to commentate. It was, yes. It was a good game. He was he was impressive that day. Yeah. Hmm. It's impressive. Lots of days. <laughs> yeah. I watched called him. Called Goat for a reason. Yeah. Yeah, I watched him a bit last this week up in Moama. What was your highlight up there, Gus? Um, I would say wake up in the morning. But a bowl spice. Um, oh, look, I, I was just really, someone said to me, you must, does it inspire you to go back and bowl better? And then I go, no, actually, it, it scares me because I just don't think I could ever be that good. It's kind of <laughs> intimidating. It has to <laughs> It's like setting your goals have to be reachable, is yeah, that right? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. That, that's it. So I did go back and have a, to Yarraville, when you know, I on my way back and had a roll. But uh, the greens weren't quite running the same as uh, on the carpet. No, look, it, their weight, you know, they don't, their, their bad bowls are through, you know, they yeah. don't bowl short. And on cue. Yes, the commentator's man. curse. It's terrible, isn't it? <laughs> I think you're being a bit harsh on yourself there. Everybody's, yeah. you know. Mm. But you don't, I did see the kitty go forward on one occasion, but generally it's going back. Yes. Yeah. No broken, no smash kitties this year? No, no, that was all good. Wasn't it Matty Flapper broke a kitty one year or went yeah. over the fence up there at my Matty's the road? broken a few things. He, yeah. Ray Jansen's bowls, he broke in half. <laughs> Those old GTs, I think they were. Yeah. Mm. If anyone was going to break, it would be Gary Kelly, I think. Yeah. Jeepers. Congrats. Right. Congrats to um, them. Uh, boys that... He's got the... Oh. Oh. I've got oh, the bowl out. He's got the bowl out. Clearly, that's what he was going for. So, it leaves Steve Adamo's bowl. But the one behind? Yep. Shot. Oh, yeah, congrats okay, to Dandy Nong and the, the Pulse for winning the... Yeah. That was a great... Um, Again. Yeah, and it obviously meant a bit to Gary. I saw him yeah, after the game. It that. meant a hell of a lot to him. So congratulations to them. Yeah, he seemed to be playing for more than... For something yeah, special so something this else time. going yep. on, yeah. Which is great. That's the great thing about sports. Stories behind the sport. So Dylan's got a bowl in hand. Hmm. He's just got to beat that last bowl of Omar's, I'd say. Yeah. He kind of come up and had a look and just went right. He didn't go all the way. No. He'll just be playing on the backhand. I think he's down. calling him forehand. Oh, he's too. The truth. Okay. I would have. Needs to cease, doesn't it? 
I know. He's, he's fine. Weight's pretty good. A little bit. Mm. It's in. Two. Two. Yep. Great shot. Played that perfectly, actually. Nice and safe. Good skipper's bowl. Yeah, well, Chris's bowl was on the way. I mean, he could have come on the backhand, but Chris's bowl was there. He probably just thought he'd see it better than us. They're having a little meeting. I, I like these meetings when they call them up just to reaffirm what they're doing. Do you have a strategy on that yourself or your rink or team? Do you like have a strategy around quarters we, or anything like that? We don't. I know some clubs do. Um, I'd like to see more of it, you know, but mm. I think it's, you know, the skip sort of controls all that sort of stuff. Again, it's a, if you're just doing it for look, you know, it, it doesn't sort of work, but Again, it has to be authentic. There has to be a reason. That's Although, I used to play a lot of tennis in early days. We got told, just come in as a, as a pairs. Even if you're talking about what you're having for dinner. Yes. Let yep. the opposition wonder what you're up to. Yep. Regroup. Yep. It doesn't hurt to just... Are you one of those skippers who let them have the first bowl and then call your meeting? Oh, Hold them up? I wouldn't like to interrupt game. No. no I myself. see a lot do it. Yeah. Well, but it's within you know, the rules. Each to their own. Yep. And if it breaks momentum up and mm. wins are made of small things. So it's 13-4 on the yeah. Jay by Lynch rink now. On so end eight. Yeah, just one to go on there. Tommy. After eight ends. Um, playing the, the Prem B games on Friday night and Saturday, you know, and then having the Prem A on its own on Sunday is a good, gives each each of those divisions, um, you know, a highlight. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Especially being new to the, it's a new concept that we've brought in. It's just nice to see it. I, I think it's uh, worked really well this year. Prem A and Prem B? Yeah. Yeah. I still think there's a bit of, you know, it'll take a couple of years just to sort it all out. Um, like anything? Well, it was interesting that the the two teams that went back to Prem B went out, didn't they? That's true. Actually. So it was interesting. Um, I'm not sure why, um, what happened there, but... Um, but that's what we were talking about earlier in Prem A as well. Often the team that goes up goes straight down. That's right. Which is why it's so remarkable to see Mooney Valley at the pointy end. Yep. More than the pointy end. They're, they're probably favourites. Probably. Yeah. But sustaining it too, you know, like Mentone and MCC had been up for a you know, fair time. You know, so, yeah. you know, it, it, is, it is hard to... You know, and it does come down to certain people in the club and things like that, you know, just keeping the momentum rolling. But um, but also you've got the pressure from below. I think that's probably largely in yeah. the competition. Yeah, and I think this season in particular, it's so cutthroat. Yeah. Like, it's the first time for at this level it's been 14 weeks instead of 18. I yep. know the other divisions cut down the year before, but you can't afford a slow start. No. Um, the value of winning points when you lose yes. is paramount in a 14 in game. Two I think or four points are, in a losing, yeah, I think absolutely. teams are sitting there now realising, you know, um, mm. that, you know, had they got a few more fours yep. rather than a zero or a two, um, they would have been on the other side of the ledger. Yeah. So something to work on for next year, be aware. Come on. And I think the fact that you know, I was around bowls when it was two points for a game. Okay. Right? So you just got two points, nothing for rinks. So it was just overall, right? How long and, ago was that, Gus? Oh, 20 years ago. <laughs> okay. Like, maybe longer. <laughs> yeah. Um, so when you were playing in a rink you and you were winning or losing, you were playing for nothing. Yeah, 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 yeah. When they brought in the rink points then, you're always playing for something. Mm -hmm. And now more so in the shortened rink, you know, it, it, it means more too. Again, so I think... Each individual game is so crucial. 
And on that, also, we also say, I always say, losing rinks win overall. So if you happen to find yourself in a rink that is going down, you try to lose by single digits to give your rest of your team a chance to win the overall. That's right. So important. Minimise the damage. Don't well, fall in a heap or give up or anything like that. You know, like, yeah, the J-Bow ring, for instance. Is yep. it, they're 13, 4 down. They've only won one end. They're yep. playing the ninth end. So they're virtually halfway through the game. Yeah. You start to got to think about minimisation, what's going on here. You know, um, let's try and keep them to, you know, under 20. Yeah. And let's try and get exactly. to 12 or something. You know, something like around that mark, you know. Exactly right. That, that's your under 10 mm -hmm. um, Losing strategy. rings, win overalls. Yep. But the main thing the for Deer Park is that Mooney Valley is still only that six or seven shots ahead, so they haven't been able to, you know, yep. um, progress on the scoreboard any further than that. So it's comfortable. You feel like this tussle on the live stream is they're still sort of, you know, there's yeah, that I, little shuffle at the beginning to see who's going to. It was sort of Take interesting, the and you know, I'd have to. I'll go back and have a look. But the first three, for instance, a lot of tenseness and that, and, and there's some really high-class balls played. Yeah. And then it was like there was a. I talked about a pressure. It was just a bit, these guys are pretty comfortable on the bowling green. Yeah, and they wouldn't be worried. I no, think. no, they just go about their business, you know. Um, and they've been live streamed a thousand times. They oh, really wouldn't be too fussed. No, I. It's there wasn't any real sense of anyone been a first Tense. gamer here. Yeah, yeah, anxiety. I mean, I'm no doubt there'd be a little bit of nerves, but not not in a bad way, I wouldn't have thought. Dylan Fisher. Oof. I reckon there'd be a little bit more nervousness behind us because that's where yep. to take all. Yeah. What's our overall over there? 23 to Melbourne, yep. 14 Bandura. Mm. After 25 ends. It's pretty quiet over there, Gus. It's very quiet. Is it 11 4? 6 2. Just having a look at some of the. 6 3 on this end rink. Yeah. To Melbourne. Very close there from Omar, just through the hole. So Bandera's got Gary Kelly there, and Benny Winth looks like he's playing three for him. I'm just seeing if they've got any other, their fly-ins. Doesn't, doesn't look it. Yeah. Lukey's there. I like their shirts. Yeah, the new ones. Yeah, yeah they're a yeah. good design, aren't they? Yeah, I, I like them. Corporate, mm. good, nice corporate. Okay, so Omar's got last ball here. It's the uh, Anthony Donoghue bowl sitting there shot, is it? Thank you. I was wondering. I was wait. I think so. Yeah. Sky blue. Yep. Uh, actually, Chris Ball's just short of the keys, probably. I, know, I don't. I think the back bowl might beat Chris's, but. Right. I'm not sure. Hard to tell from this angle. That's Braden's bowl. Yeah. Here we go. He's, trying to get He's it looking out. for it. Uh, yeah, there's Braden Ellis's bowl. He's I suspect that Braden bowl beats Chris's, so it's probably one. Yep. Yep. One to one. Deer Park. Yep. A uh, few meetings going on. Mooney, Mooney Valley seem to like their their, their, their um, group meetings. I think they've got a plan that every um, three or four ends. Well, that's good. Is this, this green looks smaller to me. Do, do, I don't know the dimensions of it. It doesn't look like a really big green to me. And that might be, sound a bit funny to people listening, but not all greens are the same size, no. you know. Like uh, you've played at Altona's green. It yeah, just feels, yeah. it's small, it's short. Yeah. You know, so when you're playing it, there is really no long ends there. Absolutely not. Mm. Yeah. So it can be deceptive. What's the maximum? 40? 40. 44 or something yeah. like that. 
but they can go down to about 38 or 36. Yeah, it can be a big difference, absolutely. And the Bandura and MCC are pretty long greens. Big greens, yep, yep. But you're right, the shorter greens, there is no long end, really. No. It's all, especially when the greens are running 15, 16 seconds. That's right. This is just... Great Braden's ball there button. from Braden, yeah. Yeah, I, I think he, he knows the importance of that lead position. He knows that he, all he's focusing on is beat Paul Lawrence. Yeah. If I beat him, it could set up a chain reaction for my teammates. And that's the way, that's what a professional leader would be thinking. They don't worry about anything else. Nah. Well, he's grown around, he's grown up around bowls. Ah, absolutely. He'd know all about it. Yeah. Who's your tip for Prem B? Sorry, Gus, just trying to have a drink. Got, um, a, got a tip for us? You've had a <laughs> look, look at some of the teams. Um, I don't know. I'm just going to sit on the fence yep. on that one for yeah. now. I really don't know. I haven't had a look at all the teams because yep. I, haven't, I haven't had a chance to do that. So I honestly don't know. Yep. Eston finished point. on top, did they? Yep. Yes, they sure did. Yep. Yeah. And, I mean, they'll be edging to get back into Prem A, of course. Yeah. Um, There's probably Essendon and Danny Nong are, you know. Hmm. Danny Nong got beat. Did, but Whittlesey beat them yeah. on Friday night, didn't they? Convincingly, actually. Did they get another? Go? They didn't get another? No. Okay, they're done. Well, there you go. No. Whittlesey be edging. They were so close before as well. Yeah. Um, I think it was the Nick McIntyre, um, Yates combination that... Uh, did it? Did the did the damage? He still got it, the old man, Nick McIntyre. <laughs> I'm not even going to use that word. Nick's younger He's than me. He's just been around for a long time. He has. Been, I remember. Uh, I played bowls with him a long time ago. Probably younger than me. Truth yeah. be known. Yeah. Good fella. Does a yeah. great job out at Whittlesea. Hello, Claire. Thanks for your comments. Uh, Brent just asking the score, Gus, for the. Melbourne Bandura game hasn't changed since last time. 23 Melbourne, Bandura 14. 25 ends. Yep. Steve again. Oh, he's just sliding under. Could still be the shot, couldn't it? Yep. Hard to tell. Yeah, well, they're probably holding two there. Oh, yeah, of course, that's Braden's mm. bowl. Braden's second bowl there. Good bowl here. Just got to get down. Full in. There he is. <laughs> Super bowl, Chris. Short <laughs> skill. Yeah, and Steve, yeah, Steve Adamman was um, commentating on, on Friday night. Yeah. They did a great yeah. I, I didn't hear it myself, but uh, they said he did a great job. So thanks, mm. Steve, for helping us out there. Good to have a change of voice. Mm -hmm. Get a bit of an inside look from the guys who are in the cut and thrust. Another one. My goodness. Look at this. I hope they can hear that at home. Oh, that is it's a lot of atmosphere going on here. It's they call it so far out too. Yeah. Well, they're not worried about getting it wrong. No. You know, they've all got each other's backs. If anyone has a little chirp or, you know. Well. Chris Ball very close here again. He's got the jack. Uh, Mark Casey, I'm sure, will just say, I'm going to shut this down. I, I, I'm going to draw the shot here. I'm not sure how close it is. This is. He's almost going to draw the plinth, isn't he? Is that yep. what he's doing yep. over there? Yep. I think the touch has stayed up. It looks like it. Unless there's more than one toucher over there. I think Case is going in the pit just yep. quietly. Okay, big bowl here. 
Sit the bowl, trail the jack is the call. So Chris moved the kitty, did he? He did. Uh, while we're watching it on the ring. He's not short. He's got a few to land on. He's got options. Yes! Yes! And on yep, top of it. There you go. <laughs> it is. Dylan's and gone redder than usual. He's very happy with that. <laughs> I hope he's got his sunscreen on today. Yes. Lots of support across the rinks as well for that, and that's that's what we're talking about with Mooney Valley. And it can happen so quickly. Mm -hmm. Like we're talking about there, five or six behind only, dear mate. Then something happens, and they can pick up five or six shots. Yep. And away they go. Omar's a cool character, oh. though, isn't he? He's he's not giving anything away there. No. He is two down, I think. That's Steve Adamo's ball, second shot up in the. Yeah. So he's looking for second shot here. I don't think he can draw a shot. He will give it a chance. It's not going to let go. Great effort. Oh, oh. Sitting right on the plinth. Great, Great weight. Effort. I mean, if that just let go, it would have been a perfect weight, didn't it? It was. So what is there from the jack to the bowl and the pit? Less than a mat width, isn't there, really? Yeah. Yeah, eight inches. Six. Probably two bowl, bowl widths. Yeah. Dylan will want to add here. Yeah, this is like this, this is important. Yeah. This is like a it's turn, good. potential turning point in the and game. They'll go up, they'll go up. Look at this. Oh, this is perfect. That wow. is perfect. Oh my goodness. Omar will be straight on the mat and he'll be looking to Here just sit that ball. <laughs> yeah. He doesn't want to give him any time to celebrate. No. <laughs> He's close. He needs to release. It's a great oh, a great ball. shot. It's a fantastic ball to be two down. Yep. Yeah, great ball. Don't even need to get on the I didn't hear what he said, but... Omar just indicated he doesn't need to celebrate. Oh, yes. Yeah. He's partying on the inside, Gus. Yeah, that's exactly right. He just did it, turned around. That's right. Clinical. It's just business. Mm -hmm. I mean, I've watched Little Bowls on Queensland, up in Queensland. you watch a little bit of this yeah, stuff? Yeah, of course. It's quite sedate. I mean, it's really, yeah. they just go about their business up there. They don't, wouldn't have seen anything much. They, yeah. The guys love this. I mean, the guys that come down here love it because it's so yeah. passionate. So, yes, absolutely. You Dylan know. will be, if he lands this bowl and sits for four, the, the boys will go nuts. He's close. He's very close for it. Oh. Goodness. Oh. I think the Omar may have been screaming on the inside as well. I was yeah. coming down. It was so in the area. Two to Mooney. Let's see, two to Mooney there. Deer Park have the mat on the next rink. So. Ten nine on ten on the show rink. I just wait for the yep. guys to move and just see if we've got that right. Eleven ends, is it? Uh, yes. And uh, eleven, yes. 10-8. Ten, 10-9, eight. Ten, is it? Uh, yeah. 10-9 on 11. Yep. And on the Bowers rink, they just got a, Matty Bowers just got a one, I think. That's still a happy home from Braden. Like, he's yeah, playing really he well. Is. Like, he is. You know, it's, a, it's always in the game if it's behind the head, behind the jack. So the Kane Nelson rink is Bowser's 10. 
And Nelson's eight. So he must have got one shot each. And that's on ten ends. Is that rink two? Yeah. What we're talking about? Yeah. Okay. Get it through it! Yes, that's right. Two ends to go on that. To ten. That's a tight game. Another good bowl by Braden. He's really bowling well. Yep. He's he's very comfortable too. Lead following his bowl down. Loves it. Yep. I mean, he's quite an accomplished, capable bowler, and he, he just loves his job that he's doing at the minute. Yep. And there's one each for J. By and Lynch too. Yeah, 15-5 over there. Uh, on nine. Is it? Can't see. Ten. Is it? Uh, 15-5 on ten. That's yep. exactly right. And our final rink is on nine. So they've got another two ends, but. Is eight all. Okay, so one each to them. Yep. Larry's got a lovely weighted bowl. Just pinched it a bit. Just, the green's probably starting to let go a little bit more. I love the matchup, Steve Adamo and um, Larry, you know, like two really experienced campaigners yeah. going toe to toe at the, at the two spot. He's taken a better Lauren, it's getting down. On cue. Ah, beautiful. On cue. Drama shot again. In every team, there's there's people that people are go-to people in the team, aren't they? There's there's like they're like the beacons, you know, the Larry Donahue or the, you know, and they. They get around them and, yep. and, you know, people know if they're, they're doing the job that reminds them to do their own. Solid. Yeah. Like pillars. Yeah. James has got a pretty good bowl here. Stiff. In the area. Yeah. Dylan's not unhappy with that. Of course, Chris Ball's not, not a stranger to being behind the microphone himself. No. A legend in the commentary. We haven't been able to use him as much this year because no. he's been busy playing. He's got yeah, a fair bowl and being here. a good dad. Yeah, he's got a little bit on. Lovely little. Okay, he's looking for the jack here. Yeah, Is they that got... right? Was that the call from Dylan? I think so because they. Sink it. They own the back with three bowls. Yeah, and he sunk it last end, so he's asked him to do it again. Is he close? Hard to tell from this angle. Quite. No. Nope. No. They don't mind having a go. Yeah, so Omar's actually... I think he's calling Chris to have a little look, but if he misses, he slides in behind, you know? Like... I think he'd like him to even, even if they went one down, he'd like to change where that... Yeah, it's a great That's home. exactly what he asked for. Oh, yeah. Oh, maybe virtually, a little bit further back. Yeah, but he virtually split those three balls. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. That's where sometimes, like you called before, it's as good as a resting touch up. It might be a yep. fair way away from the jack, but yep. it's covering and stopping the damage. Yeah. I think Dylan's still going to look for it. Yeah. He likes it. It's he likes just, it. Yeah, it's going to come off oh. the bowl. Yeah. Well, it's out of his way. Yeah. 
the value of having a couple of bowls in the head, hey? Indeed. I mean, he, he, he happened to hit Chris's bowl and pops their bowl, and only one down, so. He can afford to. Yeah. Yeah. go again. He's not wasting any time. Here he goes. A bit firmer this time. There you go. One down. Yeah. But, you know, again, worth the risk. Absolutely. Now, this is where Ivan needs to add another. He's got an opportunity here. 99%? Yeah. He's got to regain some mental ascendancy, and this will help. He's asking it to hurry. Uh, great Oof. effort. Oof. Spot on. One to Deer One. Park. At the same time, he couldn't afford to overcook it. Um, no. You, know, you don't want to give it back to them when you've just got one. No, um, that's very demotivating. Yeah. Ten all on 12. Are you out of any, you got any games to go, any midweek games or anything? You left in anything? No, all done. All done. All done and dusted. I'm just looking forward to the Vic Open now. Yeah. That's next for me. Yeah. So, yeah. trying to get back, like after having a month off overseas, I'm sort of writing my schedule for training and yeah. making sure that I... Good. You'd be nice. Yeah, you'd feel pretty fresh, really, but, uh, you know, ready for a, a reset. A Vic Open campaign, yep. yeah. What about yourself? You got any? That's a great start there, by the way. Um, we're, we finished on top on Tuesday in, in Division 1, so we played Bandura on Tuesday uh, for, uh, for, to go to hopefully go to the final and win that. So that'll be good. A couple of club games. And, Does uh, Tuesday have Prem anymore, dare I ask? Or is it, is it's there just like a, a, Division 1 is the is top. That is, yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah I know what... You, you, Tuesday bowls and you know it's oh it's, no it's, I, I played some last year it's yeah. it's, yep. it's not what the perception was it's pretty well, competitive out there we lined up about three weeks ago <laughs> against uh, J Bai's rink without J Bai but he had the other three were there there you go Chris and uh, Case and that and uh, we had Pidge so if you just wandered by on a Tuesday at 11 a.m. and thought look at those guys yeah. Is this a Prem A match going on? <laughs> yeah, there you go. It was pretty high quality. It's good practice. Yeah, it is. Yeah. And means a lot. You know, you've got a lot of bowlers out there on a on a Tuesday and uh, Wednesday nights and different games um, playing, so it's great. Yeah. It doesn't have to, all have to be on a Saturday. Are you playing in everything at the Vic Open? Uh, no, I'm not. I haven't got a partner for the mixed, okay. and I'd, oh, there you go. I'll probably just. They can do, go in a ballot to play. Like they do yeah, with I Maddie saw Ford, Maddie and I thought maybe if I did it, how would it look? You know, be a bit embarrassing for me. I would get no one to, you know. But um, no, I think I'll just do some work. It's it's Come good to have a rest as yeah, well. Yeah, it's pretty hectic. Yeah. And I actually had a look at the um, some of the pairs that are going in, and I thought, hmm. Might just give it a rest, I think. Steve stalking the bowl again. Under. He's close. Oh. It's good to give the legs a rest too, Gus. Yep. Um, if you're at the Vic Open. Yep. But I spent all night at the Pink concert last night, and I'll be... Um, Resting. I today. reckon she might be resting oh, after she, what she did last night. She is fit. Yeah. The acrobats, set, let alone the singing. She's going to nearly do a million, million people over her 20 con concerts. It's incredible, isn't yeah. it? Mm. Hasn't been done before, I don't think, by any artist. Mm. So. How old do you think she is? 
Push. 35. Push. No, no, I had a look like I was surprised. 38. She's 44. 44. Yeah. And she's still flying around the stadium yeah. like that. Yeah. Good shot, Steve. Great ball. That's the boss, I think. Yeah, that's the shot. Did he say they were three down? No, well, that's that was uh, Larry's bowl that got rolled out. Yeah, no, they said one. I think no. Dylan indicated he was holding one. Right. right. And people probably look at this Mooney Valley team and think they came up and they've done. You know, you've got to go back. This is a rebuild from seven, eight years ago. Like, they were trying to get up for a long time. Yeah. And, um, like, a few clubs, other clubs out there, and they did it. They climbed the ladder and they are here now. Mm. But it's, you know, it's not, they're not an overnight success by any stretch of the imagination. Good ball here. Great ball here. Oh, uh, you went with it. That's, yep. a, that's a better right one. On than, I know yeah. they had two, yeah. but it's a better one, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Just behind us, we've got Melbourne 28 to Bandura 20 after 32 ends. So nothing in that game really either. Not really when you consider, you know, one of the Melbourne rinks is up 13-5. Mm. You know, all that is coming from one rink. Mm. Uh, so a tight tussle. Fair weight here. It's just going to get down on. No, that's a great ball. He was disappointed with it too, because. Yeah, sorry, just looking across at the Bowser ring. Oh, yeah. You know, just update that. It's 11 ends, 10 all, yeah? Yep. So two to. Yep. Yes, two to Nel Kane Nelson and a one to. Uh, yeah. Two to Nelson? Uh, two to Nelson, yep. Ten all. Mm. Yeah, it's a pretty good head, isn't it? It is. It's super. What's the situation there? So uh, they're holding one, mm -hmm. one yellow. Larry's sky blue ball there is second shot. Mm. I mean, Dylan it's, can it's arrive on that other yellow and push Larry's ball out. Yep. It's probably what he's thinking. They have Braden Ellis at the back anyway, if they happen to accidentally pop it. Braden's been the back, just, he's got had a ball back there just about every time. Mm. Like, smart bowls. Yeah. Gives his skipper something to play to. Well, forehand, just to get down to the yellow and pop. What? Yeah, pop, pop Laurie's bowl through and sit for three. Yep. So he's trying. He's willing it to run. That was the idea, yeah. though, for sure. I think okay, what time he, got? his heart was kind of half in it, you know. He's quite happy with the way it is. Yeah. The 
looks a bit wide, isn't it? And Chris is calling it in. Yeah, it's just hanging. So you got another ball? Yep, looks like it. It's just up on the bank. Ah, right. I can't see it. So they're having a little chat. It's probably still worth it. I think so. Oh, he might have to change hands. His ball might be yeah. in the way. I'm not sure. No, it's not. Or he might change hands. I mean, even if he gets the shot ball onto the kitty, it's going to go okay. back with it. Yeah. I was surprised he didn't. wasn't a bit more adventurous with his first. Let's see if he changes. More people rolling in the door. Yeah, he's there you go. Sorry. That's more adventurous. He is. Yep. He's got it. And, oh. What's he just made? He's four. made four. four. What a shot. We've got a replay on that one. What a shot that was. So why he says one's not enough. Oh, I want four. Thank you very much. Well, it was worth it. Yeah. Isn't it? Risk versus reward. And he got it margin wide because anything you hit out there was going to cause it to come. So just couldn't be tight. Yep. Oh, they're measuring. I won't claim the four just yet. Yeah, he's, he's acknowledging he had yep. a great head. He, yep. The boys are giving him good heads to yep. play to. That's a good skipper. Yeah, well, you noted that before when you said Braden's always got a bowl behind. Yep. He's, he can play, yeah, he can play shots. Chris is sort of going, well, what do you got to do? Yeah. Um, Was it four? Three. 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 Mm. They're disappointed it was only a three because <laughs> it was such a bowl probably worth a four or a five. Are they still measuring? I oh, know. So they're still measuring it. Oh, are they? Yeah, but I think. Oh, well. James indicated it was three. They've got the umpire out, so we'll, we'll know for sure. Whilst they're doing that, we might just check the other rinks. Yes, I'm just having a look now. Can't really see anything because they're all in front of the boards. They're all just, they're <laughs> all, all these other three rinks are all about to finish their ends. 15.5 on 10, almost, so that's yeah. up to date. It's the end rink. 10.8. 10.8 to Ingham. Yep. So two to Ingham on end 11. Yes. Yeah, that's a lot. Yeah, they just finished their end. I don't know. They're still measuring. No. Four. four. It was four. Okay. Oh, no, big ball played by Kane Nelson on the next drink. More high fives. This is this pressure starting mm. to. It's starting to build, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. As does the crowd. Yeah. Oh yeah. Chairs are filling up. Yep. It's great to see this leadership too, like with these team meetings every few ends. And yep. I love it. Yeah. No, they're very relaxed with what they're doing. Yeah. Great encouragement there. Yeah. It's our length. Let's go. It's probably the shortest end they've played. Yeah, they've, they've got the mat right back, mm. but yes, you're right. Great 
great start. Like I, I actually haven't been really concentrating on the score because you're just in the game. Mm. And I've looked up, I've gone, oh, I thought Fisher was in front. Like, just the way they're carrying themselves. And I go, yeah, oh, Cheryl's actually four up. Yep. You know, it doesn't feel that way to me. Hang on. Uh, what are they doing? Hang on. We might be we might be wrong here. Let's just check the boards. Yeah, it did. Yeah, it's the other way around. Yeah. Yep. I thought was my, I was saying something. Yeah, we put the four yeah, on the wrong yeah, one. Yeah, we did. That's fine. That's right. Because I think it doesn't feel like that. No, well, value for effort. I, I think that Mooney Valley are doing the job. You know. And yeah. I thought, oh, fall behind. Okay, well, I wouldn't be that <laughs> unhappy if I was an Aaron. It's a bit glary here today. We haven't got a full tent with us, so it's a bit hard to see. How's Paul going? Now, Paul's got to go with Braden here, you know? Yep. There needs to be a uh, bit of a work rate lift, I think, in, at this stage of the game. You know, they've, they've got out to have a 12 shot lead now. It's, it's if it was a car engine, I think the red light would be coming on saying it's time to move. Yep. Deer Park. Oh, they've so J Bar got a one. Yeah. Yeah. But that, Manny Valley don't give you any oxygen, do they? No, no. It's so like J Bar got a one. Oh, well, what's the step yep. in the next ring? Bang bang. <laughs> <laughs> so we're sixteen six over there on the J Bar Lynch rink. Yep. So one to each there. Yeah. Twelve ends. You got them all. Yep. Yep. For that. The Nelson score hasn't updated. It's in our spreadsheet, but it hasn't updated on right. our screen as okay. yet. Right. He's fourteen. Oh, sorry. It's twelve ten, isn't it? Yeah. 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 I mean, if I was in Jay Bai's rink, I'd be thinking, well, we've only won three ends, but we're only 10 down. We can turn this about. Especially if you've got the likes of uh, the players he's got in front of him. Yeah, he won't be panicking. No, they'll be doing what you what you intonated earlier in the game. They'll be saying, we can be the difference now. Yep. Yep. You know? We can be the influencer in the result. In fact, the game that you were talking about earlier that we played Alex Marshall here, I think Joe yep. Bai was skipping that rink that I was in. Yeah. So. Yep. He's been here many times yep. before. Yeah. Fourteen shots in it overall. And while we're doing that, Chris just slips two shots in. Pigeon pair. Yeah, nice. Pretty good. I'm starting to see shapes in the bowl heads now. This is a scorpion. Very artistic of you. Yeah. Oh. They go up on the uh, far rink. O'Brien, Manny yep. O'Brien rink. Athletes. Yep. He's the current Victorian Open singles champ, isn't he? Matty? Is too, yep. yep. Good guy to have in your team. Great season. Great Did guy, you? too. He's super guy. Very good mates with Dylan. You know, they yeah. got a few tournaments together and that. Yeah. For a long time. Yep. 
They won the Danny Norm one. They've won it about three times in the run. They just, you've got a lot of good players in the ring. They just draw out of a hat who's going to skip. <laughs> yeah, well, they can all play anyway. They're just doing fun, you know. Dylan How's likes Dylan? this. He wants to draw this shot. He's, he's a couple down. He's close. He wants to draw this shot. They're asking it to cease. Oh, my God. Oh. He nearly got an edge of it to Braden, well, actually. The balls have kind of been holding there a bit. Mm. It's not like he didn't have enough weight for it to hold, but it, it went under. So you reckon it's two to Deer Park? I think it's two to, um, yeah. To Chris? I mean, there's not a... Definitely one. Looks like it anyway. I mean... Yeah, well, it could be three because Paul Lawrence's sky ball, blue balls out there on the right. So they're probably holding three, but it's not... Well, this is the last ball. Could they get a, a three or a four back here? Oh, he's not there. He's not there. He'll be disappointed with that. <clears throat> he's shaking his head. He's saying, what are you doing as a... Okay, the purple is the... They're measuring two as the many valleys. That's Dylan's bowl. So they're looking at which was the closest Moody Valley. The front's in and the sky blue's in, I think. Is it three? Two. Two. Okay. Two. Right. He's going to have a change of length here. Bring the mat up. He's saying bring the mat up. See, he's asked him to bring the mana. He hasn't brought it up very far. No. I think... And now he... Man, these jack rolls are becoming important. It's so important, isn't it? Mm. Having said that, you'd want it a little bit... A little bit... Maybe not exactly where you want it is better than losing the that's, jack. That's true. And then giving them back. Yeah. Yeah, this is smaller green. This this doesn't look like a three quarter length then, does no, it? No, it does not. But you know, I think he's trying to get Paul into, into the game. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. You know, Another good starting ball by Bryden. Oh, played 40 ends on the green behind us, 33 to Melbourne, 26 Bandura. So that game's uh, still in the balance. Another celebration of the Lynch rink. Yeah, you just kind of feel like Deer Park needs something yep. here, don't they? They yep. need something to just change it up. And yep. <laughs> Your scoop, Scorpion comment got a few did it? comments here. What did they say? People say the constellation and <laughs> I don't know. See if you can find a dragon saying it's the year of. Well, you're looking for something. The tea like leaves. Like Deer Park, we'll be looking for something. You know, you've got to find something now. True. I mean, they both lost games this year. 
Um, I think they both won 10 each. Um, so they've both been beaten. Yeah. Which is not a bad thing. You want no. to go through the whole season and yeah. not, when you are tested, not, no. not know how to lift. They probably both beat each other. Well, yeah, I only you looked know. at round 11 was the last time they played. Right. I don't know what happened first time round. You're probably right. Yeah. He's close again, Steve. Yeah. Goes for right. Probably two yep. to Mooney Valley. Larry's probably got third shot. Yep. The sky blue. Mm -hmm. Chris Ball will say, it's too much room for me. Just draw the shot. He's drawn a couple of nice ones going back this way. He has. Toucher. Looks to be, I don't think that's going to come back. The wind has yep. just got up. I don't know if anyone, yep. you can't see that at home with the flags. Mm. You can actually see them holding it out there. Can't do much about that, because as soon as you adjust, the wind will stop. Yeah. Oh, thanks, Colin. Mooney Valley won both. Right, there you go. Okay. Two very close games. Yeah, there hasn't been much between the teams this year. Yeah, thanks, Justin, just answering. Um, someone asking for more scores. It's all on Bowls Link, live scoring. That's probably one in, one out. Yep. Then. Yeah, I reckon they're holding two now. Yeah, they, they were. Yeah. Looks better here. Yeah, he's he wants close this. To, he wants this to hold up. Jack. Wow. Ah, uh, on, on cue, mate. Yep. Great ball. That's the one. Good shot, Disco. To draw a couple here, doesn't he? Yeah, I think so. I, I, He's got you know, like, Chris on the way in. I saw him do it all last week. They just yeah. drew, they just drew a ridiculous amount of close balls. A bit harder on the outdoor surface. Needs to let go for him. Mm. His weight's perfect, pretty much. Doesn't. I mean, we did say at the start it was 15. I, I don't know. It's not, it's not drawing like that, really. It's just got to be... There is a bit of, you know, with the um, clubhouse and that, it does swirl around a little bit. Yeah, I think the wind is swirling around. <laughs> Dylan's calling this to turn. He thinks it's wide. Let's see what happens. Yeah, he's probably right. Great Wayne. Omar will make the correction here. Does he like it out of the hand? You can usually tell by the phone. I think so. It looks like he yeah. likes it. He just wants to see it get to its oh. point and then run. Yeah, it's he pretty has. good. Yeah. Well, he wasn't going to be wide again. No. He was almost just riding the little breeze there. Yeah. So that's two to Deer Park. Yeah. Dylan can sit the bowl. Yep. Little touch of the jack. Yep. He's got two catches there. Um, your Deer Park get this, that's two ends in a row. Yep. That's a little bit of a momentum shift. Mm -hmm. It's a great game. Yep. Can Dylan shut this momentum? He's close. Yeah. He's close. He knows He's it close. too. He's got, He's got it. Got it. Oh, oh, it's <laughs> Commentator's kiss. What do we say? One it? or two. 
one, I think. One. Yeah, I think it was. Yep. One, one to Deer Park. Yep. Like you said, though, it's momentum, isn't it? Yep. One's a s small fish, a sweet, something like that. But you know what? Deer Park get one and then on the other end, you know, yep. they draw, Mooney Valley draw a shot and they go up, you know, like. It's like they're just trying to snuff them out, I think. Yeah. We got this right, 14-3. Yep, 14-13. Yep, 14-13 on 15. Yep. Four, on 14. 14? Yep. Find the guts! Sugar goes up, puts the arms in the air. You just look at the body language of the opponents when they do that. Yeah. It's hard to take. It is. It's because <laughs> Deer Park, there were, there were all these players, I mean, they're winners, right? They won yeah. the Premiership last year, right? Yep. They are denying them. Great start there. Sorry. They're denying yep. them what I call, they're denying them getting water they, they, or, or, or air. Oxygen. Yeah. yeah. Oxygen. And it feels uncomfortable for them. Mm. And on cue, Bowsey draws the shot. Just yeah. relieves the pressure, you know. How's Braden going? And that was where all that noise was, yeah. wasn't it? And he's just drawn the shot. He's just drawn so the shot and no, nothing. Yeah. 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 So he's saying play the same. Sorry, it's happening next door, so we haven't got this on the live stream. Yeah. But it's They're kind of games within games. It's, it's, it's at a really critical mm. point now. Mm. They thrive on it. Two good bowls here. Oh, yeah. So, Paul and Brayden are really having the tussle now, aren't yeah. they? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Good bowl, man. Good leading, yeah, both that, of them. Excellent. No short bowls. No. The last couple of ends um, in this rink, we've seen Deer Park get it, albeit small numbers, and you'd say that might have started at the front. It makes a difference. Remember we talked about changing the length, just trying to get him in the game. Yeah. Yep. Definitely. And that's a skipper's job, you know, to be observing what's going on in the game. Yeah. Making tweaks to what needs to be done yep. to get the best out of his players or her players. I was talking to someone the other day and he said to me, he said, oh, I had a terrible game, terrible game, he's skipping. Mm. But I skipped really well. And oh, I thought, and they won by one. And I'm like, well, that's massive, you know. And that's hard to do. Yep, that's right. It's often, a whole different skill, isn't it? Well, yeah, often if skips are not playing well, it can, affect, shot, it, it can affect their um, ability to call the game. That's right. Rubs off. Deer Park will just continue to go yep. about their business like they have done yeah. for the last couple of years. This will not phase them one iota. Larry's very close here for yeah. Jack. He wants this. Oh, so close. Good effort. Dylan says, just a touch of please. Dial it up. Great shots. It's probably three to Mooney, would that be? Yep. yep. Here anyway. Ah, look. Got class bowlers coming after them. Mm. I think so. Got it, Chris Ball. Mm. I reckon that Adamo's bowl is Steve's bowl's shot, and it looks like Paul Lawrence's bowl's there as second. Is that the okay. blue one? Yep, the dark blue. 
So I think it's only one. Yeah, okay. It's hard to tell from here. It looks different on the screen, right? Yeah. On the screen it does look like it's only one. Yeah. Taking his time here because he knows if something happens in the other ink, they'll go up, so they wait. <laughs> it's really interesting. <laughs> doesn't want to miss out either. No, he doesn't want to miss out on the celebrations. Why would you? No. There's that Toodle Lynch over there, too, on the J by Ring. I'll put that up. Just did another roll. Chris would be pretty confident he can get close here. Nothing in his way. The bowls are releasing on that hand now. This is not too bad. And it's turning. He's not there. Be a bit disappointed with that. What have we got over on Rick for? 13 hands, 11 all. 11 all on 13. On the Ingham O'Brien rink. Close. In the area, as we say, Tris. Mm -hmm. You tend to get more results when you're in the area. Yeah. Melbourne are leading by two shots next door, 36 to 34 after 46 hands played. Tight, tight tussle. One ring is up 16 6. It's Gary Kelly's ring. Uh, is six, so that's Brett Spurs rink. Yep, Brett Spur is up doing the job today for Melbourne, as he's done many times before. Great shot here from Aaron Sheriff. Well, good first, because I get bold with a jack out here. That's so positive. Mm. He's just drawing the shot and they're down. He's saying, yeah. So he's down, he goes, it's all good. You know. Be nice. Be nice. Oh my goodness. What a shot, Dylan Fisher. He's got one, one I think. He's pumped. I think it was only one. Yeah, well, we'll just wait for them to indicate. Yeah, look a bit. Two. 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 Steve gives us the nod. Mm -hmm. Three shot turnaround. Yep. Mm, I'm not liking the look of this score line. Starting to feel a bit one sided. It is a little bit. It has, doesn't, it looks one side, it doesn't feel like we're sitting here watching yeah. it. And it feels tight, you know? Shot for shot, blow for blow. Oh, now this is almost ditch to ditch. Yes. So, change right. of length. Yep. Because there was a bit of momentum going for Deer Park. And Dylan they've just, Fisher has just it shut it down. Yep. I'm going, okay, we're going to change the length again. And they're confident. Bratton will get on here. The breeze really just got up my coat can, nearly flew off the... How's he gone? He's gone pretty good. Yeah, they'll be happy with that. 
It's in the area, isn't it? Yeah. I'm expecting to see Paul respond here. Just hold up a bit here. It's a good bowl. Yep, two good bowls. One to Jay by on N14. Yep. I think Premier League came in in. Someone can tell me. I think it was 1999. I think. Okay. Been really been about 22 or 23 years. Here's an opportunity for history for these four teams. One of them can win the first Premier A. They'll be the only ones to ever do it. First one. Yep. That's a nice little thing to achieve. Yep, of course the final will be in two weeks mm -hmm. at Dandenong Club. Yep. Great supporters of ours too there. Well, mm -hmm. that, that is a great experience. If you can get down there, that'll be great. And I'm, I'm assuming the Prem B final will be on as well. Yeah. It wouldn't have been if Dandenong were in it. That's right. But was... they're out now. <laughs> so it Good will be Steve. there. So I imagine that's yeah. how it'll line up. It was fantastic there last year. But the, mm. it was just, you know... Larry got here. Needs to get down for him. Kind of looks appetizing yep. where that's ball sitting to just sort of arrive on the ball and flop onto the jack. Steve's just been there like all day, hasn't he? Yeah, he, he has. You Steady. Know. Yeah. It's going to finish in a good half. Perfect. Mm. Nearly in. Yep. When you're skipping, because I know you skip. Victoria and things like that, like pretty exper very experienced. Are you looking at your opposition? Are you trying to do what they don't do, or are you just trying to do what your team does well? Are you, do you constant? Which do you concentrate on more? I tend to concentrate on what we do, we do. well. Or, yeah. You know, I, what the opposition do is what they do. I don't want to spend too much energy no. thinking about my opponent. That's right. Yeah. yeah. What about you? Um, early days, I'll mm. I have a look at them. Yep. Um, I'll just see what I think, you know. Someone's style, from they a length, struggle. Yeah, from a length yeah. point of view. Yeah. Yep. And then other than that, you just, I think you're right. Um, if you're worried too much about your opponents, I said, I won't say who I was playing, but I said to someone the other day about someone, mm. I said, they can't, they don't get it every time. You know, don't be, don't, don't be fearful of them. Yeah. Be respectful that they won't get it every time. They're human. Yep. You know. Well said. Be respectful. So just reminding them. Yeah. 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 But this guy does get a lot. So. <laughs> well, that's the difference, isn't it? At that, a different level. Absolutely. But you've got to expect that at a certain level too. It can't be disappointed when you draw a resting toucher and somebody peels you off or something like that happens. It's. Yep. In fact, it's good. It means it's game on. <laughs> well, I think, you know, you and I are pretty exposed to a lot of good bowls, and you just do expect it to happen. Mm. And when it does, you can't be too disappointed about it That's right. either. Like, I haven't even I haven't seen one fluky result here today. No. They've all been in the area. Yeah. Good weight. You know, there's been some good, res you know, good results, you know. Yeah. Yeah, no one's missing three or four foot wide. No, no. Wicking in. No. <laughs> and no. going up and cheering. No. Nope. Must be a bit humid. The players are sort of wiping their hands on the grass and that. There's a yeah. bit of humidity in the air. 
What's the situation there? Is it one to Mooney? Uh, yeah, Steve could have two. Look at the front balls in as well. Yeah. Chris has done a good job of sort of cutting it back. Absolutely. He was stiff not to fall in. Dylan just draws another, and so everyone goes crazy next door. Yeah. Oh, good ball. Great ball. Yep. Aaron's just going about his business. He can, again, like what we were just talking about. You know what's really interesting? I can't hear the guys behind no. us, but Mooney Valley remind me a lot of Melbourne mm -hmm. a few well, years ago. Yep. <laughs> yep. It's interesting. Yep. Dylan's asking this to settle. It's close. Yep. Just added a couple. I must close again. Damn. I meant the camera not. Yep. So that's one to Mooney. Yep. That ball of Steve stayed there. Yep. You know, when it gets, we're up to nearly that 60 end, mm. it's a bit of a voodoo number for us at um, Yarraville, 60 ends, because we <laughs> generally we're leading at 60 ends and manage to find a way to lose the game. <laughs> the way we, that's how our season Hopefully went. That's in your mind. That's, that's, see, when that sort of gets in your mind, it's a... Well, it's a bit hard when Jimmy, that's all Jimmy <laughs> talks about whenever he's... <laughs> it's Jimmy's fault. Do you think they realise they're at the 60th end? <laughs> it's like, yes, They're about know. to fold. <laughs> Well, I look at the positives. That we were in a lot of games last year. We didn't win a lot of them, but we were in a lot of them. Mm. So that's that's a start. Did yeah. enough, Gus. Yeah, we did, did enough. enough. Stay up. Yeah. Did you beat Melbourne at Melbourne? Mm-hmm. Mm. And at home, I that's think. Not I actually, easy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, good start there. Yeah, great start. Mm. That's what that'll give me a lot of confidence. That. Mm. Braden might have something to say about that. He's got his own style, Braden, hasn't he? Mm -hmm. Look at those, the shirt rolled up. Yep. Looks a bit like you years ago used to roll I think there were some comments about that earlier. Right. Mm. Great effort. I used to. Mm, yeah. <laughs> Sun's out, guns out, apparently. Only. That, yeah. <laughs> Mia just saying, old singlet been bowling well. Yes, he has. That's who you're referring to. Oh, no, no, two up. rippers. Yeah. Awesome, Paul. Yeah. Awesome balls. Clap from Omar. Having said that, as as the skipper, being Dylan, you'd be pretty happy with where Brain's like. Absolutely. A few balls to. It's an unusual style of Steve's. I just saw it. Yeah. And I'd I'd heard about it, and I've tried yeah. to do it. Because he grips the ball across the yeah, top. Yeah, it's a bit more like a baton or yes. a bocce type. Yeah. That sure helps. I wonder how it would go on a slower green. Mm. I wouldn't have thought well, but I could be mm. completely wrong. Well, I'm, I'm sure he plays good up. Let's have a look. It's, 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 you wouldn't notice it if you didn't. I only just noticed it. We're more than halfway through the game, but yeah, I noticed it early. <laughs> most observant. But he's bowling so well, and look at that. Yeah, very good. He's obviously been doing it for a long time, and it works. Yeah. I always say, like, 
there's all these different styles. It doesn't really matter. It doesn't have to be textbook. Just do the same thing, no. as long as it's working. No. If you can repeat it. See you later. See you later. Look, Sean Egan's just smiling, walking down the green, going, what have I walked into? <laughs> <laughs> he just looked across at Omar. I think they just had <laughs> Yes. They're like, geez, these guys love their bowls. Welcome to Melbourne. Victoria. Yeah, they're having a bit of a laugh. Mm. I remember watching Ann Flapper last year playing with them, and it, you can't do much about it. I mean, they're getting the shots, they're playing well. You just kind of just give it to them, you know, say, well done. Yeah. They move as a unit. Now, I think we said that at the start of the game. It's just not one or two. They're all on the same page. Yeah. So Chris is probably just trying to... Tuck the jack around the corner? Yeah, or just get down to the bowls, which he has, I think. Get down to second second shot. Yep. Yeah. Good effort. Well they're holding they're holding a few. That's the Deer Park Leeds bowl on there. So Yep. That's Paul's bowl. Yeah, Paul's. And it's gone. No. Nope. Oh, yeah. So it's that's better. probably, yeah, so now it's tucked a bit away, which is probably what. So Chris places, uh, oh, he's changed hands. Hmm. It's, I think he's going to the back. Yeah, I think that's the call. Yeah. Where Aaron's foot is. No. I understand why, but... Hmm. Chris has just played a pretty good bowl on that forehand. I would have backed him to back that up, maybe snuck the kitty in a little bit. Yeah, well, That's why I'm not skipping it for Premier, Fisher. Eh? Obviously, he thinks he's going to get it, and he probably will. D Dylan is in a mood, isn't he? When they're in a mood, you want to be careful of them. Adrian Marston just saying Steve's good on. I'm sure he is. Yeah. He's been bowling a long time. Yep. Here we go. What have they got two? It's Paul Lawrence's bowl. Chris's bowl. Steve Adamaris got third shot out there on the right. Yep. And Larry. Yep. Right. I don't know. Maybe you can see that kitty. The yeah, he's playing the backhand through the cap, I reckon. Just trying to draw up to it. But they can obviously see the kitty through that gap on that backhand that we yeah. can't see. So you can just see the end of it, edge of it. You could bowl here. No, he's blocked it. I don't know. Mm. Was it deliberate? Oh, maybe. He's no. sort of saying no. 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 Computer says no. 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 It'd be funny if he did a fist pump, and then we'd know he meant that. <laughs> Pretend. Oh, I'd love to see Ezra run down the ground after one of his and just ham it up. Just not what he does. I don't think I've ever... No. It's a cool cat. Yep. They certainly let their bowls do the talking, these guys. Dylan says he doesn't know. Pretty, Not bad. pretty good. Yep. Second. Oh. Geez, that nearly just let go, didn't it? Two. Still two to do park. See, Aaron's on the mat about to play a shot. They go up next door. It stops his rhythm as well. Yep. He's looking to just draw it around for three. It's close. 
down. He needs it down. So Jay by is up. Great shot, Omar. Jay Byne must have got a four or five. He's up at uh, up to 12 now. Three to Deer Park. Yep. Yes, bit of a shift. So that's We're talking about losing rinks, win overalls, come back. So this is this is changing. This is what we want to see. Bit of change of momentum happening. Yep. yep. Right, 17, 16 on 17. Yep. See the board. And J buys, we should. Yeah, I'll go across to there in a sec. Yeah. Because it's. 18, 12 on 15. J Bai needs five. 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 Yeah. He must have got. Because that's 15 themed, yep. No wonder they were so happy when. Because um, Lynch had just killed an end. They must have been holding again. Rita Bows. And do you want the uh, Maddie one? 12 16. One to Ingham. Oh, one to each of them. Oh no, 16. You're confusing me. Sorry. <laughs> so one to Ingham. 16. Yeah. I often confuse myself. Yep, this. Hmm, 12, back to sh 12 shots now. That's gettable. Yep. It's looking a bit healthier for Deer Park. <laughs> so we're 11 ends ahead of the game behind us. Shows them what pace they're playing. Yep. Not mucking around, are no, they? No, it's just. It's tightening up behind us as well. Yeah. It's only four shots in it now. Yep. Well, in fact, the momentum has changed. Mm. It's uh, Melbourne at 40 yep. and Bandura at 44. 44. On 53 ends. Great shot again there from Steve. He's like a machine. Yep. Come on, Larry. What's Larry got? Time to shine. He's, he's just got a grip. Yeah, he's all over this. Flop in. Down you go. It's the hat from Chris mm. Ball. Yep. Put that on, you'll get a sunburned head. Yep. Yeah, Steve's... What a great ball. Oh, stiff. Just perfect weight for it. Absolutely. It? Absolutely. I'm just looking at the main board. We're ahead of the main board, so mm -hmm. they haven't updated that. We've got a couple of extra ends on there. Yeah, three ends. Can Chris repeat the dose? It's it's just not going to let go, I don't think. Lovely way. Look at the flags. The wind yeah. is blowing across, and it's the opposite direction yeah. to what it was doing earlier. Yeah. It is a swung around, isn't mm -hmm. it? Got 
quiet. Hmm? Yeah, a little bit of a lull mm. happening. I think mentally, you know, this is the business end of the game now. The players just don't, you know, got to remind themselves, you know, tune in for the last four or five minutes. Yep. Keep the noise up, get the pressure up. Yeah, I mean, it's still anyone's game. 12 shots is nothing across the four rings. Just going to look to probably squirt Jack across here. Oh. Is he there? Sure. A bit more thought going into the shot selections here. Yep. There is a shot on the forehand, a little bit more weight. Yeah. They know, I mean, when I have noticed across the greens, when Mini Valley have played some shots and that, the kitty has seems to have gone where they wanted it to go, so, you know. Doors have a little meeting, Mooney Valley again. Oh, yeah. He's close. He's just got to run a bit. He's trying to dead draw this. He mm. nearly did it, too. Oof. I mean, Dylan had a few years out of the game, didn't he? He did, you yeah. Know? So. His first year back, and he made the final in yep. the Australian indoors, too. He was up there with, and Matty O'Brien was up there. Yep. and. Needs to release for Omar. Mm. It's great effort. Dylan's still got a bowl to come. I mean, there is a bowl distance between the kitty and the bowl, isn't there? Mm. So it's drawable. I know it sounds yeah. a bit. But at their level, it's very drawable. Mm. And he's got a bowl to use to land on. If he gets the kitty. He doesn't want the kitty because Paul, Paul Lawrence has got some bowls there. So yeah, he's playing is it some... Steve's bowl splits the yeah. Paul and yep. um, Larry bowls? Yeah, so he's playing something more delicate. Mm. Does he like it? No, that's not going to hold. He's probably like one's not the end of the... Oh, it's better weight. Uh, They're already kicking. One? Yeah, one, one to, to Deer Park. Park. So on ends, who's how many ends is some Deer Park one? Hear that bit of encouragement? Sorry, I was just listening yeah. to that across yeah. the great. Come on, boys! Yeah. Ones and twos, ones yeah. are good. Yeah. They're just Walking. playing out the ends now. Every yeah. end, win the end. Yeah, win the end. Very crucial. Yeah. Are you asking how many ends in a row? Yeah, well, just two. Just two. Look at that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Just the last two. Yep. And then it was two to Mooney, and then two to. D There's a bit of a. It's interesting, you know. If you win an end, you're going to win the next one. Win the next one. Mm. It's looking like. And then they, if you lose two ends in a row, you think we've got to get the next one, you know, and bounce back. Yep. Mm -hmm. It's a good start. Mm. That width. 
that's very good. He's really um, yeah. lifted his work rate. He has. Yeah. He was in the area, I mean, but he's bowling very good now. And they're in useful positions. Very much in the zone. Mm. Yep. Good balls. Yep. yep. What's Braden got here? Pretty good. He's close. Likes it. Just got to hold. Good effort. Good yeah, effort. Good effort. Now it's been a great tussle between mm. those two. One to Ingham over there on the far rink. rink. Yep. Uh, 13, 16. How many ends? 16. Okay. Is that right? No. No. Yeah. It's not 17. It certainly says 6. It could be 18. That no, couldn't be. Just wait. We'll just wait. Yeah. Yeah, Lara's got a great, going to be a great home there. That's exactly where you want it. Falls in. Yeah. Steve goes down to have a look. Is it one to Lynch against J Boy over there? Is it 19? 19, 19 12. 16, yeah. Yep. Bouse Nelson rink, can you see it? Uh, 18 15 on 17. So four to Bouse. Mm. Okay. That's a pretty handy four. Mm. It's going to make a big difference. Sometimes you're better to chase. Yep. They're good chases. Because you know what you've got to... At least when you're chasing, you know what you've got to get. Yep. Fair ball by Chris. Just didn't quite run the distance. There's always that talk of, are you better off having to play next week as well? You know, rather yep. than having a week off. Keep I think playing. I'd rather have the week off myself. Yeah. But no, you're in. Uh, if um, Mini Valley win this, they won't have the, the, they'll all come, you know, come down. And they'll be here watching the game together and just enjoying the journey, you know. Yeah. There's nothing better than winning a division, you know. Um, I haven't been in many, only one. Here we go. Shot here. Oh, it's clean air.
There are a lot of players sitting at home today or doing something else today that would probably be wish they played in finals. For sure. It's got to be in a good home anyway. It's still coming. Good home. His weight was absolutely yeah. perfect for what he was called to do. Yeah. This is James, did you say? James Frederico. Yep. Mm -hmm. going, he's going again. Lining up. Well, he went through clean air. He goes. Okay, so it's two to Deer Park at the moment. Mm. Just chipping away at the head. Yep. So what is it, seven in it? That's um, much healthier than the 20 it got out to. Yep. Come on, Bailey, you want to Come on, boy! Come All right. I just updated the overall here. Good, because it was six hands behind up there. All right. And the Valley cry goes out. Do you want it, boys? Yeah. How much do you want this? Let go. Surely that's going to release. Oh. It's got to get up. Hmm. I think it probably would have got back. I think it just ran out of steam. Yeah, probably. It's another two, two odd feet, isn't it? Hmm. So they do grip hard at the end. Yep. Okay, so Dylan's two down. What did we say Probably about the Jake? looking to roll Braden Allen. Oh, yeah. Or just draw a second shot? Or, yeah, okay. We talked about the Jake Bowring oh, early in the, in, the, in the game when he was well down. Yep. And our prediction was keep them to under 20 and get to 15 or something, wasn't it? They, yep. They're, you know, fairly on target for that. It's 12 19 That's now. Exactly right. They've done a great job over there, they actually. They have. They have. Great shot, Aaron Sheriff. I mean, if we weren't watching this game, you'd be you'd be over there watching Case or someone, wouldn't you? You know, like there's so many great bowlers yeah. here. You know, Ingham on the on the far ring, you know. We're very blessed. That's why there's so many people here. Like it's um yeah. filled, filled up. Yeah, it has. He's close here. Just going to go through the gap. Oh. That's going to be three to Deer Park. They're just going about their business. Yep. Yeah. James. Okay. Now. There is some noise coming from Deer Park. Casey's up and about, the Green's clapping. Well, now's the time. Yep. It's, it, there's been a, a shift. All, all they need is J-Bar to do something miraculous and get him really pumped. Well, he's hung in there he really has. well. Yes. Shows a lot of mental strength. Bandura's pulled away next door, 57 to 45. Mm. So they've come over the top a bit, haven't they? Yeah, I mean, Phelpsy's rink is doing a bit of damage. She's yep. up 21-9. Yep. Um. And Sperry's up 18-12 only now. So mm. they've, they've sort of kept a yeah. lid on him. So, yep. And Sperry's someone, you, when you're playing a team, <laughs> <laughs> you just want to keep him in the box, you know. <laughs> Very dangerous player. Indeed. In a in a very respectful way, he's. Oh, uh, he's, well, he's an experienced yeah, campaigner, isn't he? he is. For the state and skipping yeah. in prem for a long time. Yeah. Paul Lawrence. Oh, wow! Great effort. Hmm. But he's putting his balls in good spots now. He's doing what Braden probably did in the first, you know. Yeah. In the yeah. First, like. It's not that Braden's dropped off or anything. It's just, I think, 
Paul's lifted his work rate and got his bowls to better positions. Wow, Deer Park have picked up seven shots in the last three ends. Wow. Two threes and a one. Now, Valley are trying to sort of get some immense, yeah. but it's not the same as before, is it? You know? It's that sort of, not manufactured, but they, they A know... A little bit. You can feel it, yeah. can't you? Yep. It doesn't feel as authentic no, right now. No. no, that's a good word for it. Yeah. Larry Donahue just says, I'll just draw the boss, thanks. Some Steve Adamo, if anyone's going to jump up, he's going to change something here. He didn't quite get that away as well as he would have liked, so it could take some weight off the bowl. And it did. That, that just. Yeah, I didn't see it, but. Yeah, you can see, just didn't quite get it away as well as what he has been. And yeah. He's going to lose some weight off the bowl. Two to Bouse over there on the last end. Set seventeen. Twenty fifteen on eighteen for yep. Bouse. Yep. And uh, Brian's picked up one on the far rink. 17-12, is it? 17-13. 17-13, I got you. Yeah, so one 17. end to go on there. Yep. I'll tell you what, I'm just going to be thinking numbers when I get home. <laughs> Trish is doing a fantastic job here with this, with this score sheet. It's not an easy job. It's well I think the glare, actually. Yeah. I just said screen. He's just come up. He just, he, Larry just came up to check what the score was. Because <laughs> I think he wants to update the main board. You see, this oh, is, this I see. Is, he wants yeah. Mooney to know they're coming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it. He's come over and checked our score yeah. and said, I'll put it up on the board. I'm not waiting around for. Not waiting around for their help. It's 70 ends. He's got a few ends to add to that, but yeah. he's got the score right. Yeah. I love it. That, that's just Larry down to a T. He's yep. just like, let's get him like on. what? <laughs> but it's a really important point, isn't it? He yep. wants them to know. Yep. He's not waiting around for someone else to no. do it. Well, I'm a traditionally, one. the second position in the end, it's yeah. his, you know. And, and it annoys me because job. when our ring gets a five or a four, mm. I want the skip. I, if I'm skipping, I'm putting that up. I go back to the board yep. and whack it on. So do I. I'm not waiting for the two to come down ten minutes later to do it. Yep, he's doing it all. Good on him. It's close enough. So Chris, oh, nearly side cuts a bowl in. So they're holding two. Paul Lawrence's bowl at the back might be cutting them out, but I think they're holding two at the minute, the yellow and the white. Chris wasn't far away from getting a good result there. And Dylan's just uh, well, he's like, that camera. I'm more important than you guys. <laughs> didn't even make a selection for this game, did we? No. Ah. It's probably a bit late now. Well, I think 
it, yeah, I agree. I, I couldn't have split them. I mean, we did talk about how tight the tussles yeah. have been. What's he going to do? Can't see. Okay. Can't see whose bowl that is behind. That's Steve Adamo's link. Yeah, and Braden Alice's. Yep. So I'm not sure. I think Braden's got it. The back one. Yeah. Well, it doesn't really matter. They've got two, haven't they? Mm. That went a bit. Oh, yeah. That went a bit wrong, didn't it? Just a tad. It was a good bowl. This could stop the momentum. Well, they were two down when he played it. Hmm. So, but Dylan is sure to draw a shot here. This is the one he wants. Mm, that's not going to... He's gone for cover. He's gone for cover. Okay. Interesting. Well, he's probably thinking about the overall here too. Yep. Um, Bowl. It's still going to be two to Mooney Valley. Yeah, Aaron knew the importance of that. I mean, you kind of got the momentum and you just want to keep it rolling. Yeah. And Dylan's got another bowl. Mm. I'm back and he'll make him pay him. It was interesting that Dylan went for cover, but Omar wasn't playing weight. No. Maybe that stopped him from playing the weight? Probably. Yeah. Mate, what do they say? Make him play the right way. Yeah. Well, James Frederico's bowl's probably in as well. The yellow one. Yeah, the way Braden was just looking at it, it yeah. could well be. Yep. Yep. Yeah, he has. Yep, Braden's indicating four. Four. Yep, it's four to Mooney Valley. That's massive That's at this massive. time. It is. And they didn't get too excited on that. They just. He sounds knew. surprised. Yeah, they, they kind of just surprised. knew they needed it, you know, yeah. so it just shows how... Knuckle down. Yeah, knuckle down. That's exactly right. Get the job done now. Yep, they've got their work boots on. Alright, this is probably back to one of the longer ends that they've played. Almost ditch to ditch. I can Braden put two on here. That's important. Yep. Last end. It's amazing. It's just crept up on us. It has. It? It's gone pretty quickly, actually. And the show rink is going to be first finished. Yep. So we'll probably stay on. Yep. And we might be able to move the cameras across for you. Yeah, well, there's a few, a few to go. Yeah. And Braden's taking a deep breath. He wants this. himself in the zone. He wants to finish on a good yeah. note. Go, go, go! They can both be proud, whatever. Oh, uh, the leads are awesome. very yeah. well. Uh, high quality. It's better. Yeah, he likes it. Yep. He likes it. It's fist pump. Yeah. Yes. He wanted a finish. Yes. Yeah. That's, that's what you want. He's happy with that. And a toucher. 
That's perfect. He's enjoyed himself. Oh, yeah, he's mm. just loved it. Mm. It's not what Deer Park wanted to see. No. He's just gone under on this. Weight's fair. Yeah, weight was good. What's gone on there? A few high fives. Yeah, looks like Jay Byne picked up some. Must be a number. Yeah. Okay. You just feel like Deer Parker starting to make a bit more noise, don't just, you, Gus? Yep. They just turned it 16, so it was a four. Four to J-Bike. Yep, 16-20. Wow. On 18. Yep. Came at a good time. <laughs> they are making, they are being the difference, aren't they? They are. Losing rinks, win overalls. Melbourne are hanging on. It's uh, 47 to Melbourne, 61 to Bandura. Just a reminder to anyone listening, just get those entries in for the Vic Open after the game. Yeah, you don't want to miss out. Jump on your computer. It's all done online. $100,000, isn't it? The, oh. the purse? Yep. Big money in good times. Hmm. Four shots in it. Awesome, Come on, bellies. Go, boys. Come on. Got a one on you, bellies. Come on. Not much splits, these two. It's amazing. As they said during the season, two no. very close games, but they both went Mooney Valley's way. Yep. So... Should they meet each other in the final? It's possible. I don't think they'd want to, Deer Park would want to go in three zip for the season. It'd be interesting because the final's inside on carpet. Yes, yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah. It'd be interesting. But Mooney Valley played very, very well on the carpet last year in the Division One final. Mm. They can play there. Of Braden still sitting there. Yeah. What's going on in the world? Uh, just some commentary around Braden's colourful singlet and how he's played. It's going to catch on, I'm sure. It's all good. Chris Ball. Mm, close. Great areas. Yeah. And Deer Park really need to be looking to just draw a good second here. Mm -hmm. I think so, rather than just chasing this yeah. shot. They could find themselves in trouble. Yeah. Like, beat the... Beat the uh, yeah, get yeah. a good second. Is it Steve's bowl out there? They need yeah. to beat. And on yeah. the wing. On the wing's yeah. got two seconds. Yep. It's otherwise you drop numbers when you're chasing, as we well know. Chris wasn't far away. He's... That's just dived. That breeze the just The wind has just come it. up, yeah. Okay, so... Omo has some work to do here. I love his walk. He never looks at all stressed. Nope. He sticks the yep. chin out and he walks up the green <laughs> with purpose. And, and he delivers. Yep. Well, there might be a few people in Queensland watching their, their players play down here today. I'm sure they've got some finals. I don't know. Don't know yeah, they're... could do. All right. Interesting. 
Oh, right. on the mat, ready to bowl, Dylan's. He knows the importance okay. of this bowl. His width looks all right. Um, is it ducking? It's ducking. They've all ducked there. Yep. He just wants a good second. Yeah. It's asking it to hold, and it's just ducked across on him. I mean, that's probably second shot, though, isn't it? Well, he'll probably want to know that. It's yeah. important to know that yep. before he plays his last ball. Because, of course, he wants the ring win, but more importantly, Here's he needs to... Shot. Here's second shot. Oh, it ran oh, on. I don't know. Yeah, it ran on. It's a good ball. This is, I wouldn't want to be playing this ball in this breeze just caught up. You can't. He's just having a moment. He's just yeah. looking across thinking, what are all the other rinks doing? What do I need to do? Well, the good thing is he, he knows there's five or six ends to go. One down's probably going to be okay. Yeah, that's right. Just... It's going to run on. Two. Two. Second shot wasn't real close, was it? So like, that's two to Mooney Valley. Yep. It's a valuable two shots to Mooney Valley. Massive. What a great game that has been. 23-20. What, what a great game. I'll do one, you do the other. Correct. All right, now let's... I'll do us, you do them. Um, what have we got? 17. We... J-Buy? Yeah. J-Buy rink, maybe? The third one yeah. across? We're just looking at which rink we're going to try to get the cameras onto for you guys at home. Rink three? It is going to come down to the the nail here. I'm just going to... Let's have a look. Yeah. One to O'Brien. some cameras around. We've got still this game is in the balance. There's some uh, something going on Maddie's rink, Maddie O'Brien's rink. He did Shawningham goes back to the mat going wow. He must have just missed that one. He missed one. one. <laughs> I now look up when the... Yeah. Because I trust that they're calling it run. The boys look like they've been to battle walking off the ground there. Yeah, well, it's humid and muggy and it's intense. Trying to move these cameras around for you. Cross. Dean goes to twenty one. Twenty one, so it was a shots. three. On nineteen. 
they're valuable. The two, the two that Moody Valley got on this last rink here, and then that three. That's going to be massive. Yeah. Passion in the game yeah. at this end. Next door, sixty eight ends have been played, fifty two to Melbourne, seventy to Bandura. It's eighteen in it. So, this rink we've moved to, the J. By Bowers rink, uh, J. Lynch. By Lynch rink, Lynch, yeah. has been an interesting one because Lynch jumped out to a big lead early. Massive. J. By's just been reeling them in. Yep, only five shots in it. And that has been the difference. Oh, in, yes. Yeah. As I said, Mini Valley's just picked up a couple of valuable twos and threes here. Yeah. Just to extend the lead. Unfortunately for Deer Park, whichever way you want to look at it, they're two losing rinks. Well, these one won as well. You sort of want your winning rink to finish last, don't you? And their winning rink is on their last end. They're That's up right. By six, 22 yep. to 16. Yep. Bowsfield is Nelson. Yep. So. It's always good to have your winning rink finishing last so they know what they're chasing. Yes, yeah, get your bad rinks off. Yeah. And these guys would all be thinking about that throughout oh, yeah. the game. The yeah. Deer Park guys would be aware of it. Just trying to see what's going on with the rink next door. But what we do know is that there's six ends to go and Deer Park need to win four or five of them. Yep. So we'll be watching for Deer Park reactions. And of course, it's Mooney Valley. It's Mooney Valley all day though, hasn't it really? Mm -hmm. It just feels like they just can't quite get there. And that's that extra five or 10% around that's, some yeah, of that, that you noise. About. That's mm. right. But you know, you also got to admire about them. Once they had to go to work in this last 20, 25 ends, they did. They just settled down and just yeah. went to work. They're not just... They back it up. Yeah, they do. It's not just all yeah, noise. I, look. And, you know, people were saying last year, you know, are they going to go to Premier League and do this? What did you get? Not sure how many, but Skilts just drew the look, shot by the look of it from that ring. Yeah, well, it was kind of a draw off a bowl. Ah, oh, I see the kitty. I see where the kitty is. Um, um, I think it was a position bowl, actually. Anyway. Anyway. Onto the ring that yeah. we can see. Bushy. Jack Thompson, Bushy's uh, opponent. Looking, yeah, yeah I sat the ball. He did two. Probably made two, maybe yep. three, two. He He's two. made two. He had that determined look on his face. Yeah. Yes, you'd want to um, have Bushy in your camp. Yeah. So Brad Gibson walking down as third. Yep. Play a shot. He's two down. He'll be looking to draw the shot, I imagine. Is that the one that calls sticks? Yep. 
That is Matt Gibson's yeah. brother. Yeah. Who, of course. So he oh, was at Bundy. Michaela. Yeah, Mac. Yeah. yeah. Michaela Gibson, who's gone to Tasmania. Tassie. Yeah. yeah. He's had a good year. Good bowler. Good guy. Oh, this is the rink that we couldn't do the live scoring on, wasn't it? Yeah. Lots of sticks done here. A little hot. Yeah. All right. Good tied up. Jacob saying, what a great match. Glad you have enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Still more to come. Kane. Nelson wants to look. Yeah. Game over there, next door. I don't know how many they got. Yeah. Mark Casey, about to. He'll be trying to just nail it, get something a bit closer, I imagine, here. Yep. Mm. Well, they need shots, so. Mm. It's not a bad home. It's probably in the count. Let's see what they got next door. Who got that end? Uh, Mooney Valley. Mooney Valley. And I think it was two or three. Two. Two to Mooney. Two to Mooney. So they've just... I'd say they've just done enough because they've been at it all day, but they've certainly um, tried to snuff out Deer Park's chances of winning this game. Deer Park, do you have an opportunity on our stream rink though? They're holding three or four. Get down. Get down. Not anymore. No. Thanks. On cue. Sticks has just drawn the shot. And they've just done it on the other rink. Matty O'Brien's just had a bowl out. Tell you what, if you could harness this energy, you can feel it, I could run you? my car yeah. at home, you know. <laughs> It's amazing, and, the, and you know, they're just getting around each other. It's yeah. it's great, so, it's, you know, great to look at. Okay. All right. So they've. There's an opportunity here. Yes. Take that. What have they got? One bow on the head for Mooney Valley. Yep. How many seconds have Deer Park got? Three or four. Mm. Hold that. Hold that. Oh. Shawningham just went through a hole that wasn't there on the other ring. Skills looks pretty pleased with his day so far. It's a nice feeling coming off the green knowing that you've left nothing out, you know. Yeah. You've left uh, everything out there, really, you know. Couldn't do more. Okay, Lynch is... If you're just looking to draw another, I would have thought I'd get another in the head. Just not going to let go. And, okay. He's trying to get another in the head now. Mm -hmm. I mean... you got It's play and stay, isn't it? Yep. Play and stay. It's got to be backhand shot. Jay's just having a chat with Bushy and Case about what the right shot is here. I tell you what, he's got a pretty good brains trust there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Having a chat to his third. They may actually be slowing this down themselves to yeah. see if they need to rip that bowl out or what they need to do, how much they need. The shorting have just dropped another, another end. Deer Park dropped another end there. I'm not sure how much it was. Uh, two? Oh, no. I'm not sure. One. one. So one to Mooney on yep. the far end. Uh, they're running out of ends, mm -hmm. I'm afraid to say. 
This is a big ball. Jay's playing forehand. Okay. So he's looking to run this ball out, is he? Yep. He's playing weight. Here it comes. Do you like it? There's another uh, one. Mm. You've got the other one that sticks us out. Yeah, he did too. Mm. Okay, he's got another bullet. Okay. Maybe that's what they were conferring about, was how to, how to get them both. But he's got one of them out, if that's... A two-bowl process, Gus. Yes. Yeah. Lynchy really needs to just put another another bowl in there, doesn't he? Yeah. I tell you what. I reckon. Oh. Uh, he didn't want that. He didn't want to land that. If anyone can do it. His weight was good. Jay can. Do you reckon Lynchy gets the best moustache in Premier League? Oh, I'm not qualified to comment on that. Right. It's a pretty good one. It's a bit of a character, isn't he? he Here is. he goes. Is he close? Kill, dump it. Yeah. Killed, killed it. it. <laughs> Nearly killed that camera. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think we picked the right game. Yeah. yeah. Good hit. Scores are right. So we've got two rinks are finished. Our televised game finished 23-20 to Mooney Valley. Very good game. So we have up and back on the live stream rink. Mm -hmm. Matty O'Brien rink is on its last end. We're just trying to get that other camera in place for you guys at home. So stay tuned. Don't leave your sets. The game next door, they're just updating the scoreboard. 55 to Melbourne, 79 to Bandura. So, as we stand here now, it would be a Deer Park Bandura game next week. If we were to stop the clocks now. Riley just asking this one to run, but his first one's holding shot. Yes, it will be. Yeah. But, the... but of course, we can't stop time, Trish. No. Can we? Can we turn back time? <laughs> like the great chair. Uh, pretty good bowl. Is this Jack Thompson? Jack Thompson, yeah. Good name. <laughs> Good shot. Bushy on the mat. Indeed. Who's holding shot there, Gus? Do you know? Ah, uh, Nathan Bush just drew the yeah, shot. Yeah, Bush is now. <laughs> <laughs> I think they've got two. It looks two. like a Deer Park one. Yeah. yeah. There's a lot happening here. Jack Thompson ready to go again. Yeah. Mm. He's close. Yeah, Bushy. Thought, so, thought it was pretty good out of the hand. I think he was. So Nathan's going to switch across to the other hand. 
try and get down to that last bowl, I think. Running over there, uh, Brian, Brian Tatens running at the head. That generally means you're down. Generally. generally, although we did see one in our yeah. game where Dylan wasn't happy with one. Jack in the pit for four. Yep. They're the things you, you know, a bit heartbreaking for the opposition. Well, I think Dylan acknowledged that end, very end. Yes. They were saying, he said, good head. Good head. Good head set up. So, acknowledging his players' hard work and diligence. He'll try and correct on Bushy's good work. He's just trying to get between those two balls down to the third shot. They have to make He's a number. He's close. They have to make a number run. Okay, it's another one in there. Probably third shot. It is. Yeah. That's three. Hmm. Interesting. They won't be rushing. No. They're waiting for next door, really. Yeah. Ryan's had a couple of drives at that. Right. Riley about to hand the ball to the sticks to Bradley Gibson. He's just saying, just nice and slow, calm yeah. down. It's good. It's, yeah. game awareness. It looks like he's going to. Is he running? Yeah, he always looks like it, but no, he, he is. A bit. Yeah. <laughs> no. Okay. I'm not sure whether that's the right was the right idea, but what am I to do to question these guys on the journey they've had? Well, they may have been just trying to take away that opportunity for a number, but mm. yeah, get rid of mm. some balls. But I wouldn't be doing it against these guys. Mm. He wants to hit that hard. It's another one. It's four. Right. Sometimes the most innocuous head can turn out to be the one that bites you. So true. You can get your dictionaries out on that word. Spell it, Gus. I couldn't. <laughs> I can say it. <laughs> He's running again. Yeah. But a controlled weight. So he's... Oh, oh, no. oh Jesus. No. Got rid of one. Wow, that was so close for the jack. Yeah. It went through that between the jack and the bowl, didn't it? Yeah. It's very tense here. Everyone's standing around mm. watching. Finding a vantage point. Jay is definitely looking for numbers here. He's like, if I hit that and come off that and yep. do this, it's a bit like pool at this point. Yeah. Snooker. No, it wasn't like the pool game I was playing last night. It's not like the pool I play. <laughs> <laughs> I always say there's three P's in pool because it often accompanies a few beverages. There's a peak plateau plunge and you've got to know when you're plateauing. Before you plunge? That's right. Give it away. What do they right. drop? Here we go. He's on the mat. Okay, so it's an umpire's call on the other ring for shot. It's J by up two. He's trying to get rid of that back bowl. Yeah. Mm. He's taking yeah. one of his own. It's not an ideal result. I think he's trying to get rid of that bowl that sits at about 
one o'clock, the way our yeah. camera yep, that's shows the... it. Yep. He was going to try it anyway. Well, they need a number. Yeah, it's hard. Twelve shots. Might be pretty much done, I think. Well, they've got another end, haven't they? Two, I think. Okay. Yeah, another end up to this. Hmm. Oh, yes, on the end. Sorry. Yep. Yes, you're right. I was thinking, why is it three or four ends? I thought it was their last... Uh... What just happened over there on that far rink? We've got an umpire out. It's a measure. Jay Neville doing an exceptional job, chocking bowls and... A measure for one. Okay. Nathan do. Surely he's just looking to draw the shot, isn't he? Yep. There's something in the head. We'll get enough on the head. Yeah. He's just drifting out. It'll end up in a good home. He's okay. going to the back. Is he going to stay up? Yes, he is. Great bolt. Running again. Yeah, looks like kill. Mm. Uh, for the big hole. Two. Two to Deer Park, and they're shaking hands. So either that scoreboard's not up to date, or they're just not sure. Well, <laughs> You've only got the 19th end. I know. So that was the 20th end. Must have been. I don't, I don't know. How many ends have they got up there? Oh. Oh, I see. So that's it. Um, that was the last end over on the far ring. So yep. they had 10 down and they couldn't. Yeah, couldn't so win. they're shaking because they yep. can't win. Yep. Yeah. Yep, and a win to Money Valley. What a great historic win that is for them. They're on their way to the final. They've got their first hand on the cup. Yep. And Extraordinary, very really, isn't it? Yeah, amazing. Absolutely amazing. The boys shake hands, and Deer Park has to come back and uh, go to work next week. Yes. But all the uh, Valley boys are in the middle, and uh, it's like another day at the office for them, I think. Yeah, they... they They'll be pretty happy with that. I think they might celebrate a little bit tonight. Uh, I think so. Um, and I think Deer Park will go away and say, look, they've got a little bit more left in the tank to come back and uh, improve on. You You learn a lot more by your, from your losses than you do your wins sometimes. Absolutely. Um, they've just got to make sure they win next week. They've still been pretty impressive, haven't they? They're mm -hmm. just head down, butt yeah. up. We're here to do a job. They haven't sort of Yeah, I thought, um, today. I thought uh, the stream ring... The boys Deer Park held up pretty well under a lot of lot of good bowls from the Moody Valley guys. Yeah. Um, certainly J Bys ring was impressive to get their way back into the game. Um, you know, there's just a couple of numbers that went against Deer Park in the last ten ends. I'd say that was the difference mm. in the end. But how they got themselves when Deer Park got back into the game, how Moody Valley responded, very workmanlike. Um, they did. Heads down. We, up. And they'll be saying out there right now, we ain't finished yet, no. guys. Don't be celebrate tonight, yeah. but we are not finished here. Your you know? job is not over yet. You know, not so done. it's exciting times for the club. Yeah. And um, can't wait to see. It looks like Bandura will get through next door. Sure does. Although it's like 78, yeah, 78 ends. It's 84 to 61. So next week here will be Bandura versus Deer Park. Yeah, wow. What, what a game, game that'll though. be. Yeah, absolutely. Uh -huh. Yep. Look, you can hear them. You can see them. That's great vision. That's what they've worked for. And they have worked very hard for this. Don't 
don't yeah. underestimate. It's like when it, you hear you're a band, you go, oh, they're just famous overnight. Yeah, it yeah. didn't happen overnight. Yeah. Everyone thought that uh, Taylor Swift, you know, <laughs> who was she, she's yeah, been around for right. 20 years. That's exactly right. So these guys are as good as Taylor. Don't worry about that. So all right. anyway, thanks for joining. Thanks, Tris, for all your hard work today behind Thank the scenes. Thank you, Gus. That. Looking forward to the Vic Open. Yes, yes. Get your entries in mm -hmm. for the Vic Open. Mm -hmm. Thanks to our sponsors today. Thanks to Brad. And uh, we look forward to seeing you here next week. That's all right. Thanks. Thanks, guys.